Full Diaper Alchemist. All right, how we got? How we doing? How we guys doing? How we guys doing? Eh? You, you all doing well? You all doing phenomenal on this fine, fine Thursday? Today's a Thursday, right? Before I look like a jackass. All right, today is a Thursday, May 18th, 2023. How you guys doing? We're back with some more Monster Hunter. In the last stream, we left off talking about how we wanted to get some farming done. Get that going. And then we can build ourselves the God land set. You know how it is. <laughs> Joey? <laughs> God. How's everybody doing, though? How are we all doing today? How you doing, Whisper? How you doing, Zangief? How you doing, Wargloop? How you doing, Whiff? How you doing, Unknown Man? How you doing, Aaron? How you doing, Mezzy? Hope you're all doing swell. Hello, Matthew. Oh, my eye. My eye. Oh, my eye. Required materials gathered. Really? God damn. God damn. Part two. Oh, gosh. Tasty barricades in the morning. Dude, I love this as an emote so much. Hold on. There it is. It's that. Oh. Hang on, standby. Hell yeah. Another good morning with Monster Hunter Ice uh, with Baron Oh, I appreciate it. Did I potentially get paid grocery money either that or tomorrow? Hell yeah. For the game with Gunlance Man and Culture? Hell yeah. Gunlance in the Ice Mod is so fun. It really is, Aaron. I don't know if you played the Ice Mod before, but oh. If you haven't, please do yourself a favor. If you do, play Gunlance. Oh, excuse me. Um. I was going to do something. I don't remember what I was going to do, though. Yeah, it's going to be this. And that's what I was going to do. Okay, let's get our knife on. Open up the server and all that so you guys can join. But we are going to be doing... We are going to be doing some solo gathering stuff for the first hour. So just be aware. All right. Mm. Oh, ho, ho, ho. All right. All right. I know last time we left off, it was at the investigate the elder dragon stuff. It's time. Right, time to head to the Wildspire Waste. We got an Elder Dragon to track. From what I can gather, the trail is more prominent on rock and sand. The proper course would be to conduct an expedition or quest into primarily dry areas. Once we have gathered the data we need, we shall report to the scholars at the ecological... <laughs> Ecolog... What was it like? How was I pronouncing it yesterday again? It was like so wrong, but I'd love to... Oh my god, I don't remember. Ecological uh, research. All right. Until next time, Hunter. Until next time, buddy. Yo. Hello, friend. There you are. We split up the hunters in the fourth and fifth to make the sh make the search for the Elder Dragon's Trail go faster. I'd like you to join us in the ancient forest and look there. Gather any evidence you can find. You can do it while you're out on an expedition or during a quest. Doesn't matter either way. Based on the info we've been able to sort through, it sounds as though the evidence will be spread over a wide area. When you've collected enough data, report it to the ecological research team. Together, okay? Ecological? I don't think I said sickle though. Ecological. <laughs> Ecological. Hmm. Hmm. I don't even know now. I don't even know. After today's stream, I have some stuff I want to talk to you about. Sure. How you doing, Lucas? And how you doing, Dude Adam as well? Oh. All right. Let's see. So that charm. Really? Oh, I just need elder dragon bones. Huh. I mean, sure. All right, cool. That's already done. Oh, shit. Good stuff. Okay. All right, so we need some Fusium more for this. <laughs> we need it for a lot of this, actually. Shit. Hmm. 
I know this is going to have level 6 shelling. But it's going to have a lot more damage. Because I think this is quite literally the highest upgrade that the chrome stuff goes in this rank at least. So part of me is like, should I go for the Nergigante stuff? You know? Because it has much more raw. And I believe it has like a ton of blue and everything too at its final level, right? We'll see. Gecko dodge sickle. Oh my god. You didn't, but I like it. Oh my goodness. Any more rupees? Like we have to cook? Yeah. Yeah, what's it called? I've been kind of just cooking prime meat and everything and then just selling like five things of prime meat. Because I remember somebody saying it's similar to the first game. What is it like? Um, I think somebody was saying like in the first game and all that too. Anything you cooked got like a 1.8 like rupee multiplier. So people would just take like, what is it? Prime gourmet meat and everything. Cook five of those together and then just sell it. But I don't have gourmet meat. I only have prime meat. So I mean, I have like a few pieces of gourmet, but I'm trying to save that for myself. Um, Do we mark down the armor we wanted to actually? Hold on. So now we were kind of like workshopping. We also need to kill a Rathlos too at some point. Oh, where is he? I know we were going to make like at least one of the Nergigante pieces though. And in these two we were going to make for the Greatsword. Because remember everybody, we aren't moving on to Master Rank until we kill everything that's available in High Rank. Which means all the Arc Tempered Monsters, right? Um, all the Arc Tempered Monsters... Uh, we have to kill Ancient Leshen and everything. And we have to kill the Behemoth and all that jazz too. So that's going to be a time. And we're giving up three levels of guard and everything to get this. To get these two, but this is a lot of attack. Like four levels of attack boost, example. Um, and then you get agitator as well. So, okay. So we just need Nova Crystal, which we can get from mining, and then Immortal Dragon Skills, and that needs tails. So we got to get those tail cuts too with Nergigante. Okay. But first, I want to talk to these Third Fleet people as well. Need my prime meats for a heart, though, and make gloom resistant meat food. Yeah. Rathalos. Rathalos. Oh my goodness. I said wrath. <laughs> you know? Wrath. <laughs> Please don't, don't laugh at me like that. Ooh, good stuff. Good stuff. Unlocked five investigations, too. Shit. <laughs> I like the music that plays there, it's cute. Lathlos, I swear. School's done? Hell yeah. So you're graduated then? This is what I'm hearing? You're a full fledged adult? Oh, that Jay is. Yerp. Good stuff, Lucas. It only gets worse from here. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Let's see. We meet again. Well, look who it is. What are you doing all the way up here? Wait, let me guess. You're tracking an elder dragon, right? Actually, that's been on my mind too. The fails of Fluvium has been getting thicker recently. I only just noticed myself during one of my veil investigations. I I remember it. the same thing happened before when the third fleet arrived during the elder crossing 20 years ago. Two decades of walking and finding nothing, but then something important changed. You came along. You found the Elder Dragon's trail and followed it. And soon you may even set foot in places that even I have never been. <laughs> right then. I'm going to try and track down what's causing the increase in effluvium. You go search the veil and see if you can pick up the Elder Dragon's trail. Okay, boss. I'm on the way. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's go to the Elder's Recess so we can gather goddamn two monsters we haven't seen. 
Why do I feel like one of them is going to be a Zorathos? I eat all meat personally. I eat them while hunting mons. I know. No worries. Oh, good. You think something about the fight the final boss? Yeah, it happens. It happens to the best of us, bud. Do your best, forget the rest. Dude, somebody might be... Oh, somebody's picking up a... Oh my god, somebody's picking up a, uh, a chicken bake thing from Costco for me. Hold on one second, I'll be right back. Hold on, this is important, y'all. This is very important. <laughs> I'll be right back. Full Diaper Alchemist. Full Diaper Alchemist. Dude, I got a chicken bake. I got a fucking chicken bake right now. Oh, fuck yeah. Who the fuck? Oh, excuse me. Who animated this? It was a uh, Skelly. I did? Uh huh. Sure, you did, dude. <laughs> It's gonna be a good day, everybody. Welcome to the stream where I go mining some stuff and then eating a chicken bake. Welcome to the stream. Oh. Wait, what do you say? God damn it, I actually skipped through it. Can you get out of here? Aye, aye, aye. Right, what'd you say? 
Most hunters choose to use a longsword. Conversely, very few choose the hunting one. <laughs> Alright, I think we already knew that. <laughs> Why, why did you make that noise? Yeah, I feel like this is a Zerathlos. Mm. <laughs> oh, I do apologize if it's just me mumbled, like, mumbled eating and all that. Yeah, it's been a minute since I've had a chicken bake. From Costco. So I'm kind of enjoying it right now. <laughs> yeah, it's going. It's going pretty good. How you doing, Sanaku? Hope everything is well. Wow, all three of the monsters are now mystery. Cool. Cool. Mm -hmm. I like how the gods locker are right there, but I still have to just gather their tracks. I'm not allowed to actually just talk to them. Don't mind me, real quick. You're all doing great. Big fan of your work. We probably should at least go spot that Rathlos before it leaves. You know? Oh, yeah. Don't we need Dodogama skin to get that last, um,. Get that last camp. I think we do. I'm trying to think of what the mystery monsters are, though. Like, one of them's obviously is Zerathos. So we just haven't actually like triggered the cutscene thing. One of them might be Beetlejuice. Ow. Don't be fucking rude. Oh my god, this chicken make it so fucking good. The Dodo Gamer? Yep. Mm -hmm. The one and only. Mm. Mm -hmm. So no rare ember. Well, that's fun to know. You're doing great things, sir. Hmm. Look at the goofy guy. He just perching. He just goofing. New boot goofing. Uh oh. Uh, we got one. Run away. <laughs> Let's see, if I were a mining node. Ooh, two in that one. Perfect. Let's see. We need two more for this first upgrade. And if we want to keep going down the the iron or like the ore tree and all that, we're gonna need 13 more on top of that. Hmm. Hmm. Man, I'm trying to remember where all the mining spots are. Having a bit of a time. this on see if this helps does it hmm well, I'm not regening <laughs> I'm not losing any I guess we haven't really oh we did spot one though before you why were you a mystery Unless you swapped out. 
I know we need to kill one of you, but I don't want to do it just yet. Howdy. Howdy. How you doing, Frost? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Yeah, we're kind of starting off the day and all that jazz with uh, some good old just gathering. Some good old gathering. Get that out of the way. Get some investigations. Checking for any rare fish. Which I need to actually check the other zone for. We definitely need a ton of... Ton of Fusium. Oh, we're also devouring a chicken bake from Costco. Not sponsored. It's just been a minute since I've had the chicken bake. It's so good. You're coming with me. <laughs> There's two spots here. <laughs> now this is gaming. <laughs> I feel like that mystery monster is just Beetlejuice, right? It has to be. Can't be Oregon because we've killed one, definitely. Um, I'm trying to think of who else it could be. Can't be an Elder Dragon. We haven't seen them through a uh, story yet. Besides Nergigante, but I don't think it could be Nergigante. Hmm. It says one of them's coming over here. If it is Beezle Juice. Well, no. Hmm. Alright, let's go this route. You know, like, there's the caves in here that have stuff. And plus, it gives us a chance to see if that rare fish has spawned. Pickle? Oh, it could be Pickle. That's right. That's a very good point there, Unknown. Lava fish? Yeah. Maybe it could be Lava fish, but... It doesn't look like it's in the areas for Lava fish. Okay, no fancy fish. But... Oh. Wasn't well, that just awkward? Better fish. Okay. I think it might be... Maybe it might be Devil Joe. I think it's Devil Joe. <laughs> hey, you. Look at him. Look at this pickle. Look at him. You're a goofy guy. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> He was straight up loafing. Ooh, we disturbed the loaf. Ooh. <laughs> it's been a fucking minute since I've seen a Devil Joe do that too. That was cute. for us down pickled loaf exactly and now we're in sen's fortress kind of crazy how this collab works huh if there's any mining spots here i know this is where we go for the gajalaka quest line but We're really struggling with the whole Fusi more, aren't we? I forgot just how much you really need. Oh, let me do this real quick, by the way. I almost forgot. And yeah, if I know somebody streams, I always try to do some shout outs. Let's see. Let's see. Bye. A mining node, and I respond. I'd be waiting for good old Banger here. Hmm. A 
I kind of want to grab a bit more food stand, but we won't spend too much more time here. Hmm. hmm. It gives me a chance to keep eating this chicken bake. <laughs> Do not perceive me. Don't. What did I just say? Ow. All right. We got what we needed. GG. Thank, of course. Of course. Mm-hmm. Mm. Like over here standing with the therapist. Oh my god. Oh my god. Before we get started with some multiplayer stuff. Let's see. I'm just broke. Huh. <laughs> well, that ain't good. That really ain't good. Is the Argosy back? Or the Argusy? coincidence that you show up as you're needed that's quite a handy skill first our deepest thanks for guiding us through the wild spire we had to have a chance to show our appreciation mm -hmm. now that a matter of great importance has come to us scholars and requires immediate attention the commander shall be attending as well come now brave hunter time is of the essence okay <laughs> this is not the good time to be eating this chicken bake <laughs> god damn it mm. Uh, I assume you call this cancel for some significant news. One second. Yes, Commander, we have a startling and rather frightful report for you. Hunter, I assume by now you are aware of nature's food chain and how it works, yes? There are predators and there are prey. It's a natural occurrence in the world. Since the first fleet landed in the New World, not a day goes by where we don't feel the ripple of its effects. But there's one dreadful creature whose sole purpose is to destroy the very foundation of the food chain itself. <gasps> Excuse me. That creature has been spotted in the New World for the very first oh. time. Wait, no, are you... Are you talking about a Devil Joe? Seriously, a Devil Joe. The hell's that thing doing here? <laughs> Excuse me. There's no mistake in it, Commander. I spotted the track with my own eyes, and I saw one loafing up. Devil Joe, the world eater. Damn it, this is bad. Its very presence is much of a threat to the ecosystem as any Elder Dragon, maybe even okay. worse. All right, here's how we're going to do things. I'm putting you three in charge of this investigation. Honors of the Fifth, get out there and find everything you can about this Devil Joe and report to these three scholars. 
We will need the fist and the entire fit to help search for tracks and clues. Once we have enough information, we can try to pinpoint its whereabouts and maybe even its next destination. Sorry to button, but just one thing that we're actually developing a new specialized tool for you hunters. And researching this devil joy will certainly advance its progress. We'll hand it over as soon as it's ready. Tread carefully out there, hunter. Hmm. Get your money up, now you're funny up. But but I am a clown. <laughs> I do the hee hee ha ha. How did a Jeffel Joe get here? Through sheer will and anger alone. <laughs> How you doing, alone? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Thank you for your patience, Hunter. We have completed our analysis of the tracks the fifth has gathered for us. Let's talk somewhere else, shall we? Follow us. We finally analyzed all the tracks you found and we're ready to report the results. We were able to figure out Devil Joe's exact location. It was no small task, though. Mm -hmm. Indeed, that beast comes and goes as it pleases. It was a miracle we were able to locate as fast as we did. If we let this chance slip by, we may never have an opportunity like this again. We posted a quest called the Food Chain Dominator. It's a daunting task, but if anyone in Astaire can do it, it's you. One more thing, due to the extreme danger Devil Joe presents, no one except the research team will be allowed to enter the ancient forest. That means, no. Alright, controller double press, because I'm using my Xbox controller. Now that the rules are crystal clear, let's go. Guess we'll never know what he said there. Nobody in the entire world will ever know. Sorry, everyone. Um, we might just deal with the Dodogama real quick ourselves, though. Hey, the portal in space, it happens. I'm good, how are you guys? I'm vibing. Got myself a little chicken bake from Costco right now. Eating that to the start of the day. <laughs> Nothing can stop us. We're on the way up. <laughs> uh, Dodo Gamma. I've got a lot of quests to go through. Huh, there we go. Dodo Gamma drama. Sorry, little guy. I need you dead so I can make a nice little camp. That's good, y'all. Hell yeah. Don't you dare. It's gotta happen. Sorry. See? Look at the little guy. Alexa, play Tokyo Ghoul Team, please. Thank you. Hmm. Point. Ooh. I don't think he liked that. Is this gonna reach? Oh! Eh, it's still it. Bear down, he's just a silly little guy. Just a little dude in combat. Peter would probably kill it though, so. So here's the thing, right? We can either kill it, a quick pain, painless death, you know, or we capture it, where then the research team will essentially just pick it apart for parts and everything over time, studying it and experimenting on it, and it put it into a fight club where it will die later on. You tell me which is worse, hmm? <laughs> The tail comes off if I remember too, right? I could have swore this thing has a tail cut, weirdly enough. Oh. Thought it was gonna hop far enough. It does, right? You know what? That was all that was all perfectly coordinated. Oh. That fucking hoit. Okay. 
got more people joining the session good stuff and yeah, when we start multiplayer later it's gonna be a good time it's gonna be a good time hmm. kind of hoping that would punch him oh huh. God, that's got a bit of a radius oh that's stunned oh spicy well i wanted you to turn the other way so now we gotta sit here doing this all right please let that be a real wall okay cool i don't like the way it's angled There we go. There we go. That was a lot of damage. What's up, buddy? Man. I miss being able to guard when you're doing a wyvern fire. <laughs> Hunting Don Donagama, how could you? Because I'm a monster. I need I need that hide in order to make this camp, right? I need you guys to understand. <laughs> Wanna see an Odegar and a Tetranodon in a fist fight? Oh, that'd be fun. I think you would <laughs> think it's an easy victory for the uh Odegar, though. <laughs> you know? How you doing though, Bane? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. What's up, fucker? Ooh! Now we're still getting hit really hard here. Oh, what a powerful Dodogama. Probably doesn't help too that we're also burning alive. Oh, he's just taking a little breather. What a silly guy. Now you could just keep doing this, but it is A-OK -okay with me. All right, all right, he's low. Here's what we'll do. Just for you guys. What if that killed it? <laughs> Just for you guys. Personally, I think that's a fate worse than death, but I mean, hey, <laughs> to each their own. <laughs> Oh, we're not gonna make it. Yeah, I should have ran right here. Oh. Hmm. We got our hide. Hmm. I forgot this thing gives nourishing extract. Interesting. Hmm. All right. Hmm. We are done with the chicken bake. No more eating while talking now. <laughs> we are good to go. I don't think we have enough money still though. I think we need 16 grand. And no trading items still. Fuck. <laughs> it ain't easy being broke. Hmm. Alright. Why do the guiding lands uh parts level down? Well that's based on the whole they want they don't want players and everything to collaborate with each other even though you can still technically get all of them to max yourself eventually even though it's very hard to do in vanilla um hmm. what's it called though yeah it's it's just the whole time uh -huh. it's a time you know i get the idea behind it but it just feels kind of frustrating in the end you know it's not really feasible for every single hunter to be expected to kill what was it like 
I think somebody said the number was like about 4,000 something Volcana or some shit like that. Well, it used to be Volcana, but somebody said that apparently got equalized between all the monsters now. <laughs> Excuse me. Ooh, what a good chicken bake. What a good chicken bake. They're telling me to hunt with others. It's because of the whole, like, there's six areas in total, right? And only three of them can be at level seven at a time. Unless you were to kill, like, a lot of monsters. Because every single time you kill, like, a, what is it, a tempered monster in the Guiding Lands, there's, like, an invisible meter, essentially, that raises that makes it so that you can actually start leveling up other areas on top of that three maxed out areas, if that makes sense. Like, the baseline and everything is you can have only three areas maxed out, right? And all the others would have to be, like, level one, right? If you kill a ton of Velcana, like, tempered Velcana, as people were originally... Um, it raises this inv invisible meter, and if it gets high enough, like, you kill probably, like, a hundred of those Vulcan and everything, um, it'll essentially start raising that, salt, like, that max cap of yours, and then eventually you can get to a point where you can have, like, three level seven areas and then one level two area. It just takes a lot of kills, like, an unrealistic amount of kills in order to do that, you know? Jim can bake, it's so good. It's so good. Was there anything else I was forgetting to do, by the way? Like, solo? Yesterday? I'm trying to remember. I mean, getting tracks, but we can just do that by... What's it called? Oh, we still didn't talk to the master there. Shit, let's do that real quick. Tracking? I mean, tracking can be done in multiplayer, though, too, you know? Just keep hunting uh, Bonboro? Yeah. Doesn't that also reach a cap, though, though? Like, if you try doing that and everything, some of them will just randomly go down. I could have swore that's how it worked there. Oh, yeah, I talked to the other lady thinking I was, you know. Hmm. There you are, I've been looking for you. Off off to the Rotten Vale to look for an Elder Dragon, are you? The Admiral's just here and told me oh, all yes. about it. Well, allow me to fill you in. The effluvium in the Vale has been getting denser. That woman over there is the one who discovered it while she was out investigating. Thankfully, she alerted me to the anomaly at once. We've observed this phenomenon once before, back when the Third Fleet and I first arrived. We determined that a monster must be lurking at the center of the effluvium. So chances are, the Elder Dragon you are seeking is the one lurking in the effluvium. Let's not waste any time. Do well. To collect it enough, report it to the Ecological Research Team. Sounds good. I think we have enough data on the Rotten Vale now. Are we ready to report our findings? Okay, cool. Well, fastest fucking run ever. <laughs> So it says grindy is the rise of anomaly investigations. So in my opinion, it's actually less grindy. It's just, what's it called? If you want to do every single area yourself, then it's going to be much more grindy, right? You aren't really expected to do that either, though. Um, what you are expected to do, basically, is essentially you get three areas of yourself maxed out, like of your guiding lands maxed out. You lock then your guiding lands, and then you go to other players for the other spots you're missing. That's what the original intent, from my understanding, was supposed to be. Like, that's where it got into the whole, like, playing with other people. This way, like, you and friends, for example, can coordinate. All right, who has these three maxed out and who else has these three maxed out? Then if you need some from the other person, like, from the other areas, you go to your friend's uh, guiding lands, you know, stuff like that. Or you go online and look for people that are using that particular guiding lands area, you know? So you're not really expected to get all of it maxed out yourself, which is a huge grind in and of itself that they don't really tell you either. Like, it's one of those people found out about it eventually on their own. But it's something you could do if you really like the game enough. Chief. Chief Apologist. Still in one piece, then. Their fleet has, God damn it, has already given it a name, Val Hazak. They attempted to the study of the target 20 years ago. Some 20 years ago, the Third Fleet observed a strange phenomenon involving the fails of fluvium levels. It seems with each Elder Crossing, the fails of fluvium increases in density. I deduce that Valensnock is the one producing it. As for how, I'll need more data in order to properly answer that. Either way, I've already told the Third Fleet Master that we've confirmed their suspicions. So talk to her if you'd like to know more. Okay. Alright, so before we go killing any of these Elder Dragon... We are going to work on getting this set together and all that. Pan's attempt to make people so... Oh my gosh. Yeah. I mean, you know, it is a multiplayer game too, a cooperative game at the end of the day. 
So it makes sense that they'd push for stuff like that. So we're still off by a bit. Okay. So I want to get this too. So we're going to need tails. We're going to need a lot of tails. At least four. Alright. So. We also need the engine stuff. So we're going to be doing that then today. Let's get some grinding going. Let's get some grinding going. What was that? I need Leggy and Joe. Okay. All right, we can do that then. We can do like a bit of turns today and all that jazz. So let's do that. Let's do that. All right, so who is in the rotation at the moment? I think there's two people, right? Was that for today alone or was that from yesterday? I think that might have been from yesterday, actually. Hmm. Okay. Alright, so let's do this. Neon. Blank. Blank. Yeah. I know Opal is here, but she didn't really join in on the. What's it called? She didn't really join in on the quest. Oh, Unknown's here too. Hi, Unknown. Howdy, howdy. Oh, we can get you in on the rotation too. All I ask is just be sure to be using high rank gear only. If you don't have a particular quest you want to do and all that jazz, you're more than welcome to skip and I'll just take your turn. But you'll still be here, you know? All that jazz. Alright, so Leon, go ahead and post your first quest, bud. Neck wait. Okay, so let's go up here. I thought that was a lift for a second. Like, wait a minute. It's a weird looking elevator. Already I've been on it. Ooh, spicy, spicy. Stay hydrated, y'all. Where did our opal go? Like, we could technically upgrade our armor right now, but part of me is like... That's actually expensive. Fuck. Um, part of me is just like, we're going to be moving on, like getting other stuff soon, so I don't want to upgrade some of these. Granted, these can be really useful when we get to the behemoth fight. In case we want to become like the tank of the group with the gun lance. Because it's looking like we might be leaning towards like a uh, gun lance uh, main, essentially, in this playthrough. Ooh, nice gun lance there, bud. Ooh. Fancy. Rouse the sack, yeah. Then you got the Evadic Center, Artillery, and Part Breaker. Very good stuff. Very good stuff there. Oh, hello. Okay. Jury Totus time. <laughs> Let's not do this. All right, we're going to put on the bandit mantle so we can hopefully grab some shinies and shit. And then go from there. Break the back and cap. All right. It's lowering too. Oh, this thing's going to die like instantly then. Oh, boy. Well, they're all best. Do our best. Probably should have grabbed actually. Shit. If it's low rank, I probably should have grabbed dual blades then. This way, one, we could try the dual blade changes, right? Ooh, excuse me. Hold up. Oh, big stretch, right? All right. So this way, we can, one, try out dual blades, see what the ice changes are. Two, I think dual blades work much better with uh, the bandit mantle than other weapons, especially slower weapons, right? Um, and make all that money. And what was the third one? There's gonna be third. Oh yeah, then we don't do as much damage too. We don't have to worry about accidentally killing it quickly. I mean, the bright side, unknown has max part breaker, so unknown should be doing 
really well when it comes to breaking shit. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Let's make sure we grab some tracks here so we know when it's about to die. Or at least hopefully know when it's about to die. Oh yeah, we got enough tracks. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. On the way. On the way. way, up, way. I'm here to help everybody. Did you guys already break its back? I see part broken. Did that just in case. <sighs> I'm scared to shoot it. Hmm. I'm at rank 90 and haven't seen a single Iron Wall Jewel. Yeah. Yeah. As much as Iceborne is like my favorite monster and everything, that's still a huge issue and everything that was a big part of just the base game, like vanilla game. Like the whole, um, that's how decos are found. That's why we're trying ice and everything in this playthrough of uh, Iceborne. The ice mod, I don't know if you're familiar with it, Bane, is like a whole like overhaul to the game and a lot of the systems in the game. One of them being that a lot of the like huge skill based, um, like her, what is it? Uh, weapon based skills and everything like decos are given to you throughout the story. So if you already done the story, you're going to be out of luck there. But on the other side of that too, from my understanding, everything, they also increase the chance of getting the more useful, um, decos and lowered the chance of like the more, you know, like, what is it? Niche ones. Like the chance of you getting like a mushroom answer and affinity slider deco, for example, is much lower than getting a like attack and coalescence one now you know something like that it doesn't make it just rain like attack plus four jewels or whatever but the chances of getting other ones are now much higher you know damn that was a silver grain too jury fin drop on the ground hmm. interesting Did that give me enough money i'm still off by a bit i forgot to even put on the goddamn mantle all right, well, in that case, unknown. What do you want to hunt, bud? <laughs> what do you want to hunt? Let's see if we can sell something real quick. Like, just sell something. Like, is there an ore that we have a lot of? We got a shit ton of Dragonite. Perfect. Baba Bay. Uppies, uppies. How are you, my child? Yeah. How you doing, Fried? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Good to see you. Good to see you here, friend. How's work been treating you? Yeah, we need Nergigante stuff now. But yeah, this is already a huge upgrade. We went up 20 raw attack and another shelling level. That's going to be huge damage. And when we get to the Nergigante one, because all Gunlance um, shelling types are now equalized across the board... There won't be a situation where, like, this only goes up to level 5, but this goes up to 6. Both of these hit 6. It's just this one only hits 6 at its max level, you know? So while this would do much more shelling damage than this, like, this upgrade and everything, this one's going to do much more raw, uh, more blue and everything, and have a same shelling level later on, along with Dragon Seal. Or Elder Seal, I should say, sorry. Rolled my ankle pretty bad yesterday. Ooh. Stay at home? Yeah. Works me busy? Oh, jeez, man. I'm really sorry to hear that. Hopefully it's not too bad. Hopefully it recovers like, quickly. Well, enjoy the day off if you can, bud. Maybe that Furious Rajane quest will drop an Iron Wall Jewel, right? I know there's the tempered uh, Elder Dragon, like those three tempered Elder Dragon quests that give a lot of jewels at the end too, but I don't know if they'll drop an Iron Wall. Because Iron Wall is the one for the guard up jewel, right? War tree gives a wind pressure. No luggy then, just Joe. Could use a gem for evade window charm. Hmm. 
Well, you're allowed to pick whatever you want during your turn then, bud. No worries. Because again, I prefer doing rotations whenever we can. I don't really like doing just my stuff. Black Diablo. Spicy, spicy. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Aim for my shield. Heavy bug on Riot. Yeah, I got it. Didn't they make it so that some of the decos, like with the last update to Iceborne, didn't they make it so that some of the decos are actually, what's it called, like... You can craft them at the Melder, or no? Am I misremembering? Or only thinking of specific other ones? Hmm. I do like the Polisher. I don't like how it's going to lose me the 5 attack, though. What does Ryder do again? He's here to mount monsters, right? Okay. Right. Any particular uh, requests here, unknown? Like, do you want a certain part broken? You want it captured, killed? Melder just rerolls them, right? I know there's like some decos you can make straight up from the Melder, but I wasn't sure if the guard up jewel was one of them or not, you know? Nothing much? Okay. No worries. We'll just go for whatever then. How you doing, Wolfie? How you doing, bud? Okay, have a wonderful day today. This camp always throws me off because I always forget where the fuck the... There it is. The item box is. I'm like, where is it? <laughs> where is it? I think... Okay, I was about to say, is there a Beetlejuice on the map? Oh no, that's the Black Diablos. Yeah, duh. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <clears throat> oh, we got our Nova Crystal. Fuck yeah. And we need that for both the charm and the armor piece. So that's good. Not old habits dying hard and everything with trying to tenderize and shit. Yeah, that... That gun that you have right there, unknown, it's gonna do work. Fuck, I was gonna do the upswing and everything and then um, try and do the... quick reload and all that to guard point it. Ugh. At least we're hitting for 32 now per shell. That's good. Because I think before we were hitting, what was it? Uh, 28? Maybe 30? Ooh. Spicy. For the earplugs. Well, now she's out of the den, they might turf for her. Suddenly I had to call my mom, so I did. We guessed about southwestern Mexican food. Aw. I'm really happy to hear that. Sometimes we all need moments like that. I'm glad you got it. Okay. Well, she's throwable now. Oh. That's okay. I didn't want to throw her away anyways. You know, that's, that's cool. I was just about to ask too, like, does the Black Diablos always win though? I could have sort of like, it's actually like a throw up on who actually wins or not. Fuck, she got enraged right there. So I couldn't throw her. I mean, we could still throw the regular one, but. Ah. <laughs> Where'd the other one go? Where did the other one go? Like, did she just go into the ground? 
Oh my god. Hey, good to have you, Frost. Good to have you. Yeah, if we do go above three people, though, um, make sure you guys, if you do want to join for some hunts, you guys use the join command and all that. Okay? This way we can make sure everybody gets a fair chance. I'm trying to do this because we can hopefully get another Nova Crystal. We are going to need another Nova Crystal. Need one for the waste, and then we need one for the artillery charm. Come here, buddy. Oh! What the fuck did I do? Oh, you cheeky. I'm here. I just want to talk. Making a mess of the place. SMH my head. Uh oh. Takes so long to get into the uh, clutch turning and another and all that jazz. That should definitely reach. There we go. I know shelling doesn't really contribute to park damage, but I wasn't expecting to flinch that or flinch there. keeps flinching when I'm expecting it not to and I'm like alright when it does the ending of this attack the tail's gonna swing back my way and it's gonna stick the worm stake into it and then it flinches oh. y'all don't do much damage quit it <laughs> hey ggs ggs sister's over staying from work cause she's feeling ill but now we can chill and talk about Zelda hell yeah that's the same sister from before and everything that you said was like a huge Zelda fan, right? If I remember correctly. Let's see if we can get more Screamer pods. Yeah, we got some Screamer sacks. That's nice. You <laughs> having fun there on them? She bought me my copy. Aww. That's sweet. Capcom ain't let me join. I uh, keep getting uh, communications there. Do you have the ice mod installed? And if you do, do you have the latest version of the ice mod? So if either of those things are a no, then that's why you can't join. Okay. Wasn't where I had to have that, yeah. Yeah, because this is a nice playthrough and all that, um, due to the amount of changes that come with the ice mod, the devs and everything kind of uh, put all the ice users into their own matchmaking uh, pool using the Steam servers and all that jazz. This way, like, the bouncing stuff we have changed for our game doesn't essentially ruin the experience for vanilla people, because sometimes weapons will be stronger, sometimes they won't, and then plus it'll prevent Capcom from seeing our changed data files and all that and banning us. Not really too interested in setting up either. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Maybe you should add ice in it, or add in the idea that ice is required. I mean, yeah, I guess we could. I guess we could. Ooh, Elder Dragon. Oh, okay. Actually, this would probably be better. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, okay. Alright, well, Opal, would you like to join for the rotations and all that, or no?
Currently farming one Zoro stuff. Hey, no worries. No worries at all. Um, do either of you unknown or uh unknown or Leon, do either of you have a Anjanath investigation? For some reason the game doesn't want to drop me one. <laughs> have you killed the other dragons yet? No, not yet. Not yet. I have an Ergagante one. Which is two silver. That doesn't seem worth it, especially with one less life. Ugh. I have this actually. Breathless and uh Anjanath. Actually, we might do this, because I do need Rathalos stuff too. I want to see what the Rathalos helmet gives and see if that's really the other part I'm missing here. So we're actually gonna do this, never mind. It's not the greatest um rewards, but it's both at the same time. Oh, that reminds me. Two birds, one stone. Oh, you're farming the Mistra, okay. How do I fuck up the word? Who knows? Angel with a Toby? Ooh. <laughs> All right. And for the Anjaneth, I do need, um, I need to get its gem. So whatever helps get the gem, essentially like tail cut, whichever part break it is. Cause I don't remember if there's a part break that does help with that or not. I'm sure there is though. Like with most monsters, you know, just keep in mind. There's only two lives though. So we just got to be careful of that. Excuse me. And thankfully, due to the story quest we got through and all that, we do have the guard up deco now. Um, We just need to have two... We need two armor pieces with two slots in order to get it to fit into this build. Either that or have the weapon have a two slot. Because we need one of them to be magazine for the extra shell, and then we need another one to be two for the guard up. Why Wrath for the helmet? Because if I remember correctly, the helmet has the attack boost uh, we're looking for. Um, still doesn't hurt to have that. Because there's a lot of armors and everything I still don't even have unlocked because I just haven't killed stuff yet. So it doesn't hurt at all. It'll be a quick kill. It'll be a quick kill, I'm sure. Just Rathalos. Um, what was I gonna do actually? I wanna see the Dodogama armor. Dan, I played a bunch of this game before, but I don't remember what exactly gives what, especially in high rank. You know? This gives two levels of artillery straight up. I'd be surprised if this was something I was using before too, actually, you know. Is this with the Anjanath uh yeah, this with the Anjanath boots and everything, that just gives um what's it called? That's artillery three, and we can just get another charm there. And this gives capacity boost. Interesting. Yeah, damn, these two are just perfect for uh gunlands then, huh? Good to know. And this gives normal shots. So if we want to get like a normal bowgun build and everything, uh this early on. Yeah, there we go. Raises your attack as your weapon loses sharpness. Also boost range from weapon melee attacks and the odds of stunning. Like that. It says non-elemental boost too, that's nice. Yeah, so the Black Diablo's horn and then the uh, Beta Gloves and all that can also go for that instead of the Damascus stuff. They're trying to put together a great sword build. Plus, it would work with the Bludgeoner, too. It would work with Bludgeoner. Ah, let's get it going. <clears throat> let's get it going. You in here as well, Wolfie? What bludgeon effect? So if you have two pieces of black, or if you have two pieces of Diablos or Black Diablos, I don't know if it was specifically Black Diablos set. It said the set bonus was uh, the bludgeon effect. 
the lower your sharpness, the more uh, damage you get. Which I completely forgot was in this game, actually, entirely. I thought uh, Bludgeoner was kind of left behind. I forgot it's like a set skill. Oh, yeah, I gotta do my shoutouts, too. Fuck, I keep saying that, too. After this quest, we're gonna sit down and do it. I think that was one of my, um... Uh -huh. I think that was the, uh, what's it called, um... Actually, let's go towards the Rathos, because the Rathos is now coming down. Or it already did, actually. Nope, we're in a fight. Okay. Ugh. This is one of the annoying things and all that about world I have is just the whole, you know... You can fast travel whenever, except if a small monster sees you, then you have to go find a bush to fuck off for a second. But let's go fight the uh, Rathlos, because they're already working on it. Oh. Is it leaving? Oh, shit. I missed the jump. Should be fine, though. Alright, we, we caught up with them. I can take a break from farming and join Q. Well, right now we have a full group. Um, but if you would like to join after the rotation, you're more than welcome to. Found some Elder Dragon evidence. We're making good progress. Yeah, that paralysis is coming in clutch there, unknown. We weren't kidding. Hey, good tail cut. Not me trying to fucking sprint with my gun lance. Did I hit them both? I think I did. Perfect. Ooh, let's not run into that. Bring out the dancing dogs. God, that damage. Good throw. Good throw. Kind of tempted to kill the Rathian now, but... Alright, head's broken. Preferably, if we can capture that. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, Noon and I are on the same brains. <laughs> brain uh, wavelength right there. Oh, yeah. We're on the same brain brain. <laughs> oh, we got a tail at least. Ow. Door point. Ow. Up. Oh, yep. Go fucking figure. That attack is the one that stuns me. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> We get stunned by that attack and we get hit when we're getting back up. Feels bad. Wait, didn't I carve the tail? Why is that still there? Wait, did I have carver proc? I did have carver proc. Bro, really? Ma'am. Miss ma'am. You got me with a cheesy fucking kill and you came back? What a dickhead. I gotta get that tail though before it disappears. That is not that skill issue. Oh, there it is. There it is. Alright, come here. Oh. Ooh. Tame it away from uh unknown there. Ah, 
Ugh, that little ledge it's on. Wait, what? Oh my... <laughs> the shell... Oh my god. Oh. That's funny. I was like, wait, why didn't I get the mounting attack there? And I think the shell actually flinched me out of the air. That's funny. I gotta get flinch free. I really do. I kind of want to go finish off this Rathian because we started it. Oh, he's already working on the engine now. Okay. Well, if you guys get close to death and all that, can you guys uh, make sure you capture it, please? That's not where I wanted to turn, but I did anyways. Surprised that didn't hit, to be honest. Oh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, this isn't gonna happen though. Authority about to cap it. Please grab it. Well, that's already about to be capped then. No point in dealing with this. Let's see. see the things on it though there goes the tail stuff it is capital interesting so there it is perfect it's like the mine not hit. Very strange. See calculated. Uh. So it just became capable then. Okay. <laughs> we got another scale from the thing. <laughs> yeah, I was sitting there like uh I have max evidence though, and it's not it doesn't show capable. Still no gem. Stun resistance, so that's nice. Totally didn't almost fuck it up. What do you mean? Hmm. Alright. Thing was capable? Well. Uh, <laughs> nice. Alright. So because we just finished that rotation and Wolfie just joined. What's it called? So, okay, so Whiff is there. Okay. Oh my god. Let's see this. Yeah, we just finished the rotation, so. 
We're gonna keep Wolfie and then grab Whiff in here. So Leon and Unknown, if either of you would like to rejoin again. You know what to do, just use the join command and all that jazz. Re-enter. Oh, keep things as fair as possible. Appreciate the help. Alright, so now let's see with this real quick. So Rathos, was this the one I'm thinking of? Yes, this is exactly the skill I'm, or exactly the armor thing I was thinking of. He's an attack two boost. Yep. That's exactly what I was thinking of. Okay. I'll draw my main my turn, no worries. So what we're gonna do actually. Because we're going to have uh, six points of attack boost already with this waist, the Rathalos helmet, and then the bone chest we're using, right? That's six. We're going to have the last point of attack going into the gun lance um, with the deco we have. And in the gloves, actually, we're going to keep as Ergon. This way we have at least one level of guard. And then we're going to put the... What's it called? We're going to put the guard up deco we got in here as well. So our gloves are going to be handling guard up and guard level one. Um... Our waist is going to handle the magazine, which is going to give us an extra capacity. And then our boots are going to be the Anjanath boots, which we already have on now. And then we just need to upgrade the artillery charm to level 3, and then we'll have max artillery. And at the end of the day, the build is going to have max attack boost, artillery level 3, guard 1 with guard up, um, and a magazine. Lots of damage. Like... When I was doing the off-stream playthrough and everything of this, with just friends and everything before, didn't finish it, of course, but... What's it called? Um, I was able to carry this build into Master Rank halfway through all of Master Rank because of the amount of damage it gave. Now, is it fashionable? <sighs> yeah, let's see what it all looks like together. So we don't really need this anymore, to be honest with you. Would it be a nice thing to have? Yeah, but we don't really need it. So, this is what we're going to look like. This is going to be peak, peak fashion. <laughs> Excuse me. How you doing though, Pelica? Do Gunlance users get guard skill? Uh, what do you mean? Like, should they just get guard skill? If you're asking like that, then yeah, they definitely should. Helps a ton. Need to get some drip? Oh, well, we will eventually. I'll just let you choose all the quests. I don't want to really... I don't really have anything I want to farm. Hey, no worries. No worries. We... Excuse me. We have um, two... Or what's it called? We only have one open slot, though, for this group. Because this turn... This rotation is going to be with Opal and Wolfie. So if either one of you want to join for that last slot, go ahead and use the join command. I know Leon's asking in chat, unknown, if you see that or not. Um, hold on. I want to turn off uh, the helmet, though. Just hide it all together. Okay. All right, so Opal. Where's she at? Long asleep back up. Oh, huh? What now? So, if there's more than three people, we have people do the join, like, command and everything, right? Um, the reason why we do that is because it makes things fair for people, and because we had Opal and Wolfie join, um, and everything when we are doing the last of the rotation, which is my quest, we're starting a new rotation, which means everybody in that rotation gets taken out of it, and new people get brought in, but we have one open slot, so that's why I was saying if either you or, uh, Leon want to join, you guys can either figure that out now, or just use the join command, all that jazz. Do this just to keep things fair for people who do want to join. Guy armor's looking like some bad 90s wrestlers. Hey, what do you mean bad wrestlers, huh? <laughs> if y'all don't look like this, y'all doing something wrong? Oh, me, oh my. Session 16 player. Well, I know that. Yeah, it's just 
the quests are only four players, you know? Yeah, I'm not asking people to, like, leave the entire lobby or something like that. It's just leaving the rotation, you know? Like, at the bottom of the screen. All that jazz. Yeah, I don't mind people joining the lobby, though. There, people are allowed to hang out in the lobby. But, yeah. Oh, pal, uh, go ahead and choose a quest. Why do you want to hunt? Yeah, unfortunately we can't really do true rotations and all that until we get into mastering. Like these ones are going to kind of be just like semi-rotations for people that are trying to put together high rank builds. But, again no. People are more than welcome to skip their turn if they would like. If they just want to kind of just do hunts and all that, you know? Let's... Excuse me. Does world have transmog? I want to run around on my cute spring armor. It does. Um, what's it called? True. The true transmog and everything though happens later on though, like at the end of master rank. Like you can still get transmog like in high rank and all that, but what is it? Um, it's mostly from um what's it called? Uh, either event quest or like pre-order bonuses or um. Mark tempered stuff. Oh, Opal's in a quest. Okay. That's a war government or Okay, so oh my god. Okay, this is getting way too this is getting way too complex. Opel skill issue. Ease up on the skill issue joke there. It's only allowed towards me. Um, what's it called? This is getting much more complicated than it has to be. So who's joining and who's not? Because <laughs> Tiger joined, but then Tiger said, now, never mind. So now I'm just like, what's happening, guys? <laughs> I can wait on this open, right? Well, that's the thing. I saw that Tiger joined the queue and then Elune joined, so it's like, okay, cool. Still no taking things very slow, no worries. Hoogie Lantern, yeah. Join Elune instead of, uh... Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna put... I'm just gonna put Warglobe in. We're gonna go from there. All right, <laughs> we're just gonna go with that. Okay. Um. Okay, so Opal's still on a quest then, huh? Okay, in that case, we're just gonna do, all right, we're, Wolfie, go ahead and post your quest, then when Opal gets out of hers, then uh, we'll have her post hers. And we'll go from there. I did things too fast and Altron and Fatalis filtered me, yeah. Any quests? Yeah, any quests that you want to do, yeah. Any quests. So if you want to do one of those Elder Dragon ones, we can do that. If you'd rather do just farm stuff, we can do that. Up to you. Yeah. Now the Altron fight's just rough because of that whole elemental skill check. And then uh, you got Fatalis, which is a really nice challenge. I love how hard Fatalis is. It's fun. Picking everyone out enjoying just eat the cute palka food, yeah. <laughs> oh, hello. Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, he doesn't have the last camp. Okay. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Want Rathos armor? Right. Yeah, no worries. You know, uh, Whisper, here. Here's what the spring platter, or platter looks like for this event quest. It's so good. It looks so good. Big ol' honey ham, prime rib sandwich. Oh. Less than 1.3k Alatrons on main. Spicy. Hey, good stuff. Very good stuff, unknown. Alatron is extra and fun for a gun main? Yeah. Yeah, unless you're running like an elemental bowgun build. And even then, what are the shot zones on, um. What are the shot zones even like on uh, Alatron? Is that I'm not even sure. Ancient Force is still confusing me, especially when coming back to the game after a few days worth of a break, yeah. It can definitely be confusing at times, but... That's what you get the scout flies there for. They're so cute with their little wings and the food looks so tasty, yeah, honestly. I love the little events in this game so much. Okay. Wait, are there any rocks up here or no? <clears throat> I don't have anything I can really send it with. Let's so just tenderize and do it ourselves. Get from this. Oh! Your point. Ugh, I was hoping I can do the slam into a guard point. Substantial. Ugh. I was not trying to go into the fucking little hidey hole there. <laughs> Ooh. Trying to shoot it with the dump or was at the bomb pod and then flash it so it can go into the water. But my character's like, "Ooh, we're gonna go in here instead." He just wasted it. Why must food take so long to cook? Honestly. Why couldn't it just be done, you know? Have you, have you guys ever seen the Spy Kids movies by chance? Do you remember like the instant food things they had in the movies? I wanted those so bad as a kid. That's the wall taste. Oh. Guess what we forgot to do, by the way? Forgot to set our shoutouts for the 50th time. Hey, it still landed. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, concrete. Uh oh. The Rathian is aggressive. There she is, woman of the hour. Um, I don't have bomb pods or something to throw. Shit. I was gonna say this would be great to throw them into each other, but now I'll just throw poop. Oh, I don't even 
have a worm stick. That's awkward. Capping this, by the way, or are we killing this Wolfie? I don't know if you specified. Well, there's the other one. Oh, didn't want to carve the tail. Cap it? Okay. I don't have evidence on it, actually. Hmm. I said there's a red scale around here, no? I don't actually know if it's low or not. That's for Kushala. Hmm. Hmm. So the spot that I was searching for for 20 minutes. Oh boy. If you've already been up there before, Pelica, um, if you open your map, go to one of the resource nodes up here and then click in your right thumbstick. Like go to the egg nest, for example, click in your right thumbstick and now set your scout flies to track like up to that item and location. And this way you can use them to get over there. Ooh. That's a rare one, I think, if I remember correctly. Bruh. Oh my god. Hold on. I don't remember if that's the rare looking one or not. Ooh! Got the fucker. Okay. Oh. Hit him with the folding chair. Yeah. I haven't been able to find evidence on if it's low or not. Mantle can now be used again. Nope, oh, and they're calling each other again. Look, this higher rank uh, Luna I'm breaking out them or such. That's the oh boy. So there we go. I say arms, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Jalaka are aggressive. There it is. Should 
GG. GG, yo. Master skill she read three tries? What do you mean? Exact same thing happened to me when I was trying to catch this guy. Spicy. Not backflip mania? Yes, backflip mania. <laughs> And I used Rathian to lead me to the nest. Even had the waterfall killer when seeing the hazard for the first time. It was pretty animated to fall with her. Never stop moving. Oh gosh. <laughs> had your own anime moment. Where's the clutch claw? I was using it. I think we have enough data on the ancient forest now. Want to report to the ecological research team? Okay. Spicy, spicy. Um, I don't really like either of these. So we do flora. What's up? She died in one hit. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. So are you ready to do your quest then now? You out of the Lunestra? Excuse me. Master killed me twice. I got tilted and brought the MRS and I said, and she has to go to die in one hit. It happens. <laughs> it happens. Clutch, 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 clutch. <laughs> yeah, thankfully, again, with the ice one and all that uh, fried, we don't have to tenderize the monster nearly as much as we used to. Yeah. <laughs> you got a Luna gem, but at what cost? I mean, hey, you got a Luna gem, though. What makes Luna so bad in the world? Always hear stories about her. She's super responsive. She's super responsive and aggressive and everything as a monster, then has constant, like, heat aura stuff you have to deal with along with the wind pressure. It just turns into a really, really tough fight at times. But I mean, like, she's, like, super responsive and all that, like, she'll be targeting somebody else, right? Um, she'll be targeting somebody else and attacking them, and if you attack from her side, she'll quickly look to her left, do, like, a swipe to the left, and then return to her target looking forward, it felt like, at times. So she can do stuff like that, which can really throw you off, and the whole wind pressure stuff, she does a ton. And then, what's it called, um... Then you have moments where, like, if you try to flash her and all that, she gets mad, and then, guess what? Goes into her supernova early. So you got stuff like that. Are tenderized parts considered weak spots? Yeah, no, um, because of the ice spawn and everything, that got changed. Weak spots are just weak spots, like, whatever has a high hit zone value. Um, so if you're hitting a high hit zone value and everything, then you're gonna be doing, you're gonna be proccing weakness exploit. Um, in vanilla, you needed to tenderize the spot and everything to get the full effect, but yeah, thankfully the ice mod gets rid of the whole, like, you have to tenderize the spot to get the full effect of weakness six point. Are some weak spots locked behind some clutch claw? I mean, so you have cases like, what is it? Anginath legs, right? The Anginath legs have terrible hit zone value for Blade Master, right? Until they're broken. If they're broken, then they're fine. Bear Girls mode? Okay. So we got to do a quest then by ourselves and get all the items on site. Oh, hello. So in that case, we're going to just do an Anginath Sholo. We're going to do an Anginath Sholo. Where's Anjanath? Where's Anjanath? Yeah, so you guys are more than welcome to do like some quests without me and all that jazz, because I don't know how long it's gonna be. Longsword? Oh boy. Okay. We gotta figure out a longsword then. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. And Opal's turn? Yep. Maybe yeah, it's Opal's turn, but Bear Grills means I gotta do it solo. I gotta do a quest solo. So, let's see. Yeah, you guys are more than welcome to do some quests without me, though. Let's see. What are we going to use for a longsword here? We could just go the ore tree. 
would be easier. Oh, we're just going to do that then. Let me just post the quest I have. <clears throat> Excuse me. No, you're good. I appreciate it though. You're good. You guys can, yeah, you guys can do your own quests and all that. And then when I get back, we'll keep going with the rotation. Fuck, we're missing Fusium again. Oh, well. Please, it'd be funny. Uh-huh. Dealing with a monster with much more health. <laughs> I see your game. I see your game. I'm getting you a free kill, huh? <laughs> I see your game here. Let's do attack charm. I'm gonna go for this. That. Um. Really don't have any great arms here to use, but that's okay. Oh uh, yeah. We're not gonna have the best skills with this set, but we do have attack boost and crit eye, so we are gonna have some crit going in here. So we're gonna make use of that. Let's see. Okay. Okie dokie. Let's get... I would like the weakener. I would like the weakener. Alright, so with Bear Grylls and all that, we gotta go into this without any items whatsoever. We gotta put away everything. We have to find all of our items on set. Or in the quest and all that jazz. And then do it solo. So let's get it done. Oh, See, now yeah, this would be a good weapon to have, um... What's it called? To have with... The Nergagante gloves. With the agitator, you know? Um... Where are we gonna fight this at? <laughs> oh, gosh. Let's go to the ancient forest, because I feel like it might have better supplies there. Okay. Oh, we gotta make this solo too. Hold on. Just in case somebody tries to be cheeky Hi. and join. I think Let's see. we have enough data on the I think we have enough data. Me, 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 me. All right. We're gonna do this. Do that. All right. Just for you, Fred. <laughs> trying to remember how the hell ice or was it the ice longsword plays though, because I know it got changed. Like some stuff, like some of the moves are only doable if you have um your spirit gauge and everything. Oh yeah, we can't grab this either. Fuck. Can't grab any of the supply box items. We have to gather everything. You know what to do. Ice long sword is such a pain for me, yeah. I need to remember what exactly is different about it. I think I remember one of them being like, oh, it doesn't lose, um... It doesn't lose, uh, spirit gauge over time, but... What is it, like, stuff costs more now? And, like, if you miss, like, an attack, it doesn't use any of your spirit gauge, but if you do land the attack, it always takes all of it, some shit like that. All right. <laughs> nice. Nice. All my muscle memory left, especially considering you can no longer EI spirit slash unless you have max build up. Flash and bar. Interesting. And the EI slash is the sheath counter, right? Yeah, I couldn't reposition versus uh, Luna because I didn't max my bar, right? Is 
that's... I'm trying to remember what that is. Because you have special... Sp special. You have special uh, sheath. Yeah. You can't do the ice slash, huh? That's the ice slash. Right, let's grab some uh, heals here. EI spirit slash. EI spirit slash. Oh, you mean like the right trigger combo? We're also going to have to try and see if we can find some poop too, actually, because we are going to need um, some dung bombs just in case things get a little hairy. Out of the way. I hide here. Now we're looking for first, not first aids. Um, we're looking for heals, like herbs and stuff. Ooh, there's some poop right there. Perfect. Let's grab this mucus. Attacking special sheath, right trigger. Oh, that one. Okay. Yeah, the okay that's yeah that's what i was talking about then yeah that's the thing i was talking about okay because yeah, i can't do that right now without any of the gauge but maybe that's just because i don't have any of it but Oof. who knows anymore i can't remember the names for the life of me Okay. Definitely want to grab. What's it called, though? Let's see. So it should be herb to the left. Blue mushroom, I don't think we really need, though. I'm gonna try and grab that honey too, but yeah, we should be able to grab it. Grab this just so we know where the Rathlos is. Let's see. More herbs up here. Alright, so we're doing fine. And I think I see a flashback to the left as well on the map. So we're gonna grab that too. No, it's a wiggly itchy. No, there was another bug here, though. We would see it if these fucking... Oh, the jaggy don't aggro at everything. There we go. Oh, there it is. See? I knew there was one here. Now we have a flash pod we can work with. So. Let's grab some more honey down here. Some mega potions going. Let's see. Some honey above us. I think it's the Anjanath that's going here, though. I mean, something's going here, but... Unless it's the Rathlos? Well, we'll find out. <laughs> find out eventually. Okay, cool. Alright, I think we have enough. I think we have enough. We got max po or we have a max amount of potions on us and then herbs and everything to make even more. We have six mega potions. All we gotta do is just not get hit, you know? Easy. <laughs> Easy, right? <laughs> What's up, fucker? I'd like more mega potions, but we'll be fine. And then you like roar instantly. That's why I didn't even bother trying to clutch claw. Oh. Yeah, you're just gonna roar again, so. Here. I need you to tell me how tasty this wall is, though, real quick. Okay. Yeah, 
All right, thank you very much. Ooh, he's gonna try and do a counter there. Oh man, I forgot I can't do the fade slash without the gauge. It's gonna be interesting. Get this out so we can start making some money. I'd love to tenderize the legs, but I don't know if we're gonna get a chance to. Oh, Ooh, stinky! You got a torch pot? You got the torch pot instead of the. Oh my god. Take a fucking breath, man, buddy. go knocked him out of that forgot we have to do that oh suck fucking ninja nerf Ooh, yeah, that timing's a bit different I'm used to. I tried to do the fate slash backwards and all that, but. Oh. Okay, enough with the roaring. We get it. You're loud. Ooh. Grabbing this because we need money. Ooh, take a breather. You want to so bad. Ooh. Pod disappeared. Was bad. Why do you keep sneezing all over the place? Now we're on our way. I just realized something. We technically hmm, we need to make sure we don't eat a meal actually before the next uh, bear grills though. So we're supposed to not do that. I think we already did before we got the redemption, right? I don't remember now. I know I'm talking about the attacking special sheath right trigger. Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about, the trigger one. Yeah, because I know there's the regular slash, but I meant the trigger one. That's what I was talking about before. I was just saying the regular slash, though. Yeah, I was getting the wrong name and everything, but we're talking about the exact same thing, though. Yeah. So no need to be sighing. Oh, come here. Ooh. Oh, there goes the tail cut. Spicy, spicy. Now imagine if I hit any of those and didn't get it at the end, huh? Oh. Ow. Fucking oi. Tell me you saw that fried. So I know you like your longsword gameplay. <laughs> yes, sir. Hell yeah. Nope. Yeah, so I can't hold that as long as I can in Sunbreak. Interesting. Taste my Nippon Steel. Oh! <laughs> I'd have enough stuff for these. Oh god, we gotta watch our health. We're taking too much chip damage here. Woo! 
And Giant's a little bee. He's a disgusting slimy boy. Oh boy. Just shoot him in the nose. Ooh, he did not like that. Are you throwable? No, you look angry still. Are you angry? You angry at me? I think he's angry at me, guys. Okay, aiming that feels much different than I'm used to. Ugh. Now let's go carve that tail before we can, before we forget. Monster you're tracking is about to leave. The engine at it better not. It's the monster's objective. And another fucking scale. What is with all the scales we're getting from these tails? It's just Anjanath, though. Now I'm thinking about it. It's just the Anjanath tails that are giving us all these scales. I don't get it. It makes no sense. That's, you know, that's perfectly lined up. Like, I smell somebody looking at a perfect opportunity. Oh, that didn't even reach. Cool. Goodbye. <laughs> Jesus. We hit the uh, weak leg too, so that's good. Did that count? I think it did. Okay. And then unfortunately, because we don't have the opportunity to make trap tools and everything we can't really just make a trap on site you know yeah whatever Ooh. this is not the best place to be fighting launch the front oh damn we missed the head by just a smidgen. That would have been sick. Yeah, longsword's still fun. Definitely different, but it's still fun. Feels like they changed it to be less spammy with how often you can get those counters out, which is like, it's fair. I need to see like what kind of upsides they did though for his just nerfs. Come on, do you think? Oh, I... Let me try to sprint with the longsword. <laughs> Ow. Ow. <gasps> oh, sweet! Can you still go for the tail cut even though it's already cut off? <laughs> We did this with blue sharpness too, that's perfect. Perfect. Come on, out of the way, little guys. We gotta go. Is there something to turn off the screen edge darkening, by the way? It happens to me all the time and I don't vibe with it. Um. I think that's called screen vignette or whatever it's called. It might be screen vignette. See if there's like an option for that in the graphical settings. Yeah, it should be screen vignette or something like that though. Oh, I'm trying to kick your ass. Get back here. I'm getting tired, boss.
We could let it go to sleep, but where's the fun in that? What's up, fucker? Oh. Can we kill with a wall bang, though, eh? <laughs> nice. Yeah, longsword's fun. Longsword's fun. I feel in volumetric fog, yeah. And the volumetric fog in this game is dog water too and just kills performance as well. Which by the way, another, you know, another PSA, just turn off, what is it? Here, let's look it up together. Volume rendering quality, just turn that off. This kills FPS and everything and all it does is just give you, you see what just happened in the background? You see that blue little fog? It's like a very slight detail effect that's not worth the FPS drop. It is not worth the FPS drop, in my opinion. I don't know if anything else here is uh, worth it or not either, but... Yeah, vignette effects, this is what you want to turn off. You see? It gets rid of that little border around the screen. Here's this Kingdom 10, Perfect 10, oh boy. Well, don't, yeah, don't say anything about the ending, but hey, good stuff. Glad you, glad you feel that way. Flint tree? <gasps> oh. One day. One day we'll get our flinch free. Oh, hey, it's Devil Joe. Yeah. <laughs> I think we have enough data on the ancient forest now. Want to report to the ecological research team? And so you have off, on... Hi, all that jazz. Kind of want to turn the snow quality up to high, just to see. SH diffuse resolution, though. I have no clue what this is. By doing this, more details are shown at a distance, which is nice. So when do those flowers disappear then? Now I'm curious. Hmm. Oh, they don't disappear at all. Interesting. Interesting. Hey, it's Joe Hell, yeah. How you doing, by the way, man? I don't remember if I asked or not. I know, I just be thinking, right, yeah. I know you were saying earlier about that. You know, the music that plays during the You Went So Car ads for Antipiracy in the early 2000s was pirated to make that ad. Really? That's funny. Oh, gosh. How you doing, Karai, by the way? All right. We're going to do a little bathroom break right now. Um, and then when we come back, we're going to continue where we left off with the rotation with Opal's turn. Load bias is... I know what load bias... Or I know what the lot bias is. It's just, what's it called? Um, I was trying to see, like, because that one was the one that sets, like, how far and everything from my understanding it is. You know, like I get what lot is. I was just trying to see like the uh, difference with that setting and everything, you know. There you go. All right. We're going to go to bathroom breaks. I'll be back in a bit. All right. See you guys soon. Full diaper alchemist.
Full Diaper Alchemist. Okay. Alright, we're back. How you guys doing? You miss me? I miss you guys. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Use the Monster World Potato Mode on my PC, right? Yeah, this game can be pretty demanding at times. Which bathroom so you guys think he's going to choose? Mm -hmm. The one under his desk? Oh my god. One in the back rooms, yeah. How do you think that carpet got so yellow in there? <laughs> god, that's awful. Alright, Opal. What do you want to hunt? If she's back. I know she said earlier she's going to go get a sandwich. Oh, she's on standby? Hell yeah. That's unknown. And this is open. Okay. Let's do this. Only we had more Fusia. You know? Alright, Wolfie and Leon, where you do at? Oh, they're already in a quest. Okay. They're doing their thing. Oh, insurance. And provoker. Ooh. I don't think anyone here is prepared for loan, which is what I want, but I heard you need an engine. Well, I appreciate it, but... I don't even think I can join for Luna. Don't I need to be a higher HR for that or no? Just some knock devil Joe. Ooh, spicy. Luna's supposed to be in? Right, yeah. That's what I was saying. Like, uh, I don't think I can even join for that. Why is aliasing off? It's like, why does everything look so just shiny? I don't remember which aliasing I want to use. So just stick with this one. I always get the, uh, What's it called? I got all the alias things always mixed up. Like which ones do what? What am I missing chat for? I have enough HR, which is what I said, right. I mean, when you said like, I don't think anybody is prepared for it. That kind of sounds different than like, if I can even do it or not, you know? Like I just don't have the gear for it, which I don't have the gear for it too, but. Like he's almost said, no worries. Too baby for Luna? Oh my goodness. Speak my land set? Sure. The Devil Joe? You are ready, my friend. Hell yeah. Did you get a new uh, charge blade, by the way, Haloon, or no? Oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's this. The Taroth Crest Sleep. 180. Okay. Oh, you got razor sharp installed. That's good with the flinch free. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, two levels of flinch free. If I remember correctly, though, isn't it something like, um, what's it called? Isn't level one flinch free, like basically level three flinch free, though, in this game? I'm sure you got this set and everything just for the, uh, what's it called? The crypt boost, though. Like, or this piece for the crypt boost, not the flinch free, but. I'm just curious in general, though. Spicy, spicy. Yeah, lots of crit there. So is that just the weapons crit, then? Or is that the crit? No, that'd definitely be the weapons crit. Because you have crit I-15. Unless the weapon has negative. So you're at what? About 75% crit when you're hitting a weak spot? That's nice. Very nice. And a non-elemental boost, too. That's really nice. Razor sharp, so you keep that blue longer. Then crit boost for whenever you do land the crits. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. This flint tree is on accident? Yeah. No, I figured. 
still need mats from Diablos. No worries. I'm not using the master rank one. Right. I know. I just don't want you to, like, go from, like, uh, being super huge damage to then, like, literally doing nothing because using, like, a really low weapon. You know? Sorry to keep you all waiting. You're fine. No worries. Yeah, again, I don't mind waiting little bits here and there, but... Yeah, if it turns into a situation where, like, you're asking me to wait, like, a good 15, 20 minutes, then it's like, okay, well, we're going to do something else then in the meantime, you know? Yeah, I don't mind waiting, but I do like to keep things constantly going on stream if we can, because, you know, I'm trying to make sure the viewers are entertained and all that, too. Um, I already got that, huh? Okay. Okie dokie. Hey, Fry, you making any more progress in Tears of the Kingdom, by the way? You play some more, bud? Or do you plan to play some more today while you recover? working a bit right now. Ooh, nice. Doing at home stuff. All that jazz. We stand a working man. It's gonna knock me off. Oh. We were just far enough he couldn't reach me. Where the fuck are all these footprints? I don't wanna get the mucus, but oh it's like I know there's a footprint around here which is much quicker. No, that's poop. Why'd you have to turn that way? Oh. oh well. Oh well. Come on, give me that tail. Give me that tail. Want that meatball? Give me that meatball. Give me the mucus too. Oh, there's a fucking footprint. Just made it through. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. I do like the fact that, uh, what's it called? The spirit cage doesn't diminish over time, I guess. You know, that's pretty neat. Let's get this for the Devil Joe later. I don't know if we're going to need Devil Joe parts, actually. I think we do for a charm, but... I might be wrong about that. Oh, I wanted to do a jumping attack, but the game's like, nah, fuck you. You're getting pushed back. Oh. Did I turn on the right aliasing? Because, man, oh, man. Oh, no, I think it might be the log thing, actually. Because we turn on the log distance to be very high. I'm noticing we're just hovering, like, under 60. Yeah, 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 we'll be fine, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. <laughs> we'll keep it the mid for now. <laughs> Just don't mind all the action going on back there. Oh yeah, definitely an FPS just jumped. Woo! Stabby, stabby. By the way, am I the only one that unlocked a shrine that goes away in tick or Tears of the Kingdom? I-19 not explored. One unlocked a shrine that goes away. I don't think so. I don't think I've ever had that happen. Are you sure it went away or did you just lose track of it? Ooh, perfect. Hoping to do a fate slash there, but then we don't have enough juice. Go 
Good stuff, mate. Oh man, those purple effects kill FPS in this game. Oh, oh God. We got the gem. Oh, thank you guys. Oh, thank you. Fucking hell. That's done with. Ladies and gentlemen, we got them. <laughs> this game I'm probably gonna gr actually grind more in than uh breath of the wild hell yeah so you enjoying it more than uh you did breath of the wild then at least basically here i got a trap for this thing if we still want to cap it where is it i thought i was gonna walk past that one god damn it all right ggs I mean, unlock. Oh, okay. Okay. You mean you just get the fast travel? Okay. Oh yeah, I do that too. Oh, I do that too. Because I've noticed, like, that game and everything has huge, like. I'm trying to think of the best way to describe it, right? Um. It has huge, like, ooh, a shiny kind of syndrome. At least I guess I can call it. I don't really know how else to call it. Like. There are so many things to do in that game that if you have a sole objective in your mind and everything, um, you're going to have a time and everything trying to focus on an objective if you keep like trying to do everything along the way, which is a good way to play it, especially if you're playing it casually. But I have a hard enough time as is keeping track of one goal. So I've been trying to, at least recently, like if I have a certain goal in mind, like, all right, I only want to do this. If I see certain things along the way, I'm going to mark it down for later, like Korok, for example. I've been marking them down if they're the ones that are like, oh, help me get to my friend, you know, because those take a bit to do. Um, if it's a shrine and I don't want to do a shrine right now, I'm like, I'm going to mark, I'm just going to unlock the fast travel and then come back to it later, you know, all that jazz. Is it my turn? Yes. Yes, sir. Have a hot day with Lunestra, pun intended. Oh, gosh. Okay. No worries. Thanks for joining, Opal. Thanks for joining. In that case, we're going to get somebody else in from Q. And then they'll stay in for the next rotation, too. You know? Who's the next person in queue? It's a loon with the message. <laughs> Cat face, I swear. All right, loon. Let's get you in here, and then you'll be joining for the next one as well. Also, how you doing, by the way, Pokelol? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. I forgot that. Yo, we got our gem. All right, let's get a loon in here. There we go. And how are you doing as well, Indora Prime? Hope you're having a wonderful day. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. So we'll get a loon in here for the fourth person, or third person, technically. Ooh, excuse me. Oh. Yeah, we're going to upgrade the charm. Cool. So now our gun that's build is going to be doing shit tons of damage. Is that requiring Teo parts? If that's requiring Teostra parts, then that might not be too bad, actually. Huh. Okay, cool. Alright. Can we do Joe? I don't see why not. I unlocked the quest and everything to do it myself, but... I think because I have that and everything, if you do your version of the quest, then might do mine as well? I don't know. I really don't know. All right, so because we got that artillery charm upgrade, let's see. Let's see. Yeah, we have max artillery now. Cool. So now our damage is back up to full, at least with artillery and everything. Another 10% damage and the shelling charge time is reduced as well. Oh, hello. Ed, what about you? I'm vibing. Can't complain. Teo gem, teo horn, yeah. It's like, that's Teo stuff, isn't it? Yeah, so that's going to be good. We could definitely get that. Well, that's Opal. Yeah, uh, Leon, where's your quest, bud? 
Let me check someone. Mm -hmm. Can we do numbers? I hope so. Mm. Looking fancy there, Wolfie. And your Rathalos gear. Are you going to be going for the Nergigante stuff, by the way, Wolfie? Because the chest piece is, like, perfect for you. What is it? Stamina Surge along with um, Agitator, I think it was. That'd be perfect for you, Wolfie. Ironhorn has win and so does Devil. Uh, Leggy and Tio are on his tremor. Rather Leggy or Tio? I mean, I don't know if I can... Maybe I can do Tio? No, oh, I don't have the Tio unlocked for the tracks yet, personally. But I mean, if you could post a quest and I can join it, then fuck it. I'll just join for it, you know? I don't mind. Unlock your cutscene first. What the hell does that mean? You have to unlock the cutscene first, right? Okay. Just got a deck of her too, right? Yeah, what is it? Um, here, let me check it real quick. Yeah, if I don't have the cutscene for it, it's like, I don't know if I can actually fight to you yet. And I still need to get more tracks in the Wild Spire. Yeah. Yeah, see, look at this. Two points of stamina surge, one thing of agitator, and then a level one slot as well. I saw this and I was like, oh, Wolfie's going to love this, son. Maximum might not too great, though, of course, but... Yeah, if you get, like, the alpha... What is it? If you were to get the alpha chest, uh, gloves, and waist and everything, that'd be perfect for you, uh, Wolfie. And then you'll get the Nergigante hunger, but... I've never really noticed the health regen that comes from continuously attacking a monster with a weapon. From this skill. I've never personally noticed the, like, regen on that. I kind of want a leggy jump for evade window. Hey, it's up to you. Whatever you want to hunt, bud. It's unfortunate there's no leggy on and everything that spawned in the, uh, what is it? Um, Elder's Recess. Also, that'd be really easy. Two birds, one stone, you know? You can't fight Tio? Okay, cool. Yeah, if I don't need the cutscene, then. It's up to you, though, bud. Oh, I want it, yeah. Me. Well, it's a good thing I need Nergigante stuff now. <laughs> so it's two birds, one stone, you know? For us. Is this high rank? Or is this low rank? Oh, this is low rank. Wait, you need the gem though, right? I thought you said you needed a laggy gem. Or Leggy Gem, yeah. So you need the post high rank then. Does Leggy even do annoying one? A Leggy or You need gem plate? Oh you need both. Oh, okay. Hi. I mean the wind on Leggy on isn't too bad, I think, personally. I don't think it's too bad personally. We get to the Nergigante grind, at least for my turns and all that. We're gonna have to get some tail cuts. That's gonna be fun. Um, so what part breaks and everything help with the plate? Uh, so we gotta break the back, the head, and the tail. Alright. Sound good, folks? In one piece, then. You figured out what an ancient dragon or elder dragon is. Okay, Shaldera, the command of wide territories. You probably heard of it itself. It's one living in the world, and we have to study it. All right. Well, I didn't want to talk about that. I want to just get that research thing up. Okay. Yeah, I'm assuming capture it, but. It'll be fine. Let's put away the dancing dogs. We've been bad about that this playthrough. Leaving them dancing when they don't have to dance anymore. By the way, have you guys seen the uh, new trailer for Mortal Kombat? Good lord, that's gory as hell. Super gory. A 
Looks good though. Let's just to see what it like where it goes. Grab this. So we already have max research level with low rank leggy, but what's it called? Just don't want to get the tracking down. Let's get up there. It looks cool, doesn't it? Hi, I'll hope everyone's joined the day. I'm excited to see folks playing Icewind. Hell yeah. Yeah, the Icewind's been a blast so far. So I played a ton of Iceborne and everything on console myself. So when we were starting this playthrough, I really wanted to do like one with the ice mod, you know, instead of just doing another vanilla playthrough. You yeah, know? How you doing though, I be doing? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Where's the other beetle? It's right there, right? Yeah. Beepy. <laughs> oh, come here. And I love gun lance in the ice mod too. It's so fun. Oh lordy. Now the back break though. Oh shit. Ooh. Well, uh, that's a little awkward. Can I reach that from here? Come on. Come on. There we go. Uh oh. What the dog doing? Oh, goodbye. Don't do it. Pick a spot for the love of God. Come here. I just want to talk. Oh. Oh, hey, we got it off at least. He's fighting in this area so goddamn much. There's a sleep toad here I'm kind of tempted to hit it with. Nope. Oh. Rude. I am not on the leg, or the tail. I am on the leg. I did the guard point a bit too late. So again, it doesn't start until a bit after the animation starts. What are you doing up there, Wolfie? Nope. Welcome back, Wolfie. See, so now I'm going to go over here so I can grab this shiny. Oh. Oh. Yep, and now it's going to chase me. <laughs> what a time to be alive. <laughs> I'm hitting it. Fuck it. Oh. Is he going to actually put the monster to sleep or is he going to put us to sleep? Let's find out. Oh. Hey, it worked. Totally calculated. <laughs> I'm gonna send it. I wanna hit it on the back, but. Here, I'm gonna try and hit it on the back. Something broke. I don't know what, though. I'll take it. Oh, man. Oh, I had the Vitality Mantle shit. I wanted the Bandit one. Good throw. Is that the tail we broke? No, that's just tenderized. It's like, let me just get this off, even if we're gonna hit by that. Hey, everybody, I want to invest too much time in the console, and I've been enjoying ice myself. Hell yeah. Hey, that's good to hear. Again, it's a really well done overhaul so far. I'm excited to see how the entire game feels going through with it. I usually prefer ice in my drinks. Oh. oh, you are so lucky I don't have the voice mod active right now. Oh, you are so lucky, Fried. Count your days. <laughs> Count your goddamn days. Kirai <laughs> 自宅は森王町北東部の別荘地帯にあり、結婚はしていない。仕事は亀雄チェーン店の会社員で、毎日遅くとも夜8時までには帰宅する。タバコは吸わない。That actually just reminded me, right? Funny enough. Also, howdy, Raven. <laughs> that reminded me, the other day, people used two cringe blocks back to back. So I actually have to increase the price, and I forgot to do that. So thank you for the reminder. <laughs> oh, right in the forehead. Oh, there goes the forehead. Now we just gotta break the back. 
and capture it. Coping, coping and seething. Oh, I went to guard point there. You're seeing. Coping, coping and seething. Get it, damn it. Where's my shock drop? Why the fuck is it all the way over there? Okay. Or just don't let me place it. Why are you placing it there? Uh, it's gonna fly away now. Oh, it's gonna fly away, 100%. There you go. I wanted to place it right under, but I guess because we're sliding it then Ah, yeah, yeah, whatever. Price goes up now. A <laughs> wink. Winks with both eyes. This is the weirdest switch hat I've seen. I don't know what you're talking about. Channel points. Hold on. Match rewards. There's a... Uh... Yeah, that was supposed to be 7,000, actually. So you got a bit of a discount there, Raven. So now if it happens again, though, it goes up even more. So choose wisely. <laughs> okay. Oh, shit. All right. Hey, another plate. All we got to do is just not want things and then we get things, you know? How dare you, Bear? How dare you? <laughs> mm? <laughs> Alright, cool. Aloon, what do you want to hunt? It's now your turn. Check chat, villain. Check chat, villain. Who's the villain? My cute cringe saving hedgehog. <laughs> Could you give a rundown? The on the shell is so confusing. So basically, right? Um, I'll showcase it more in the next one. Like talk about what does what. Bear, I must know. Usa, usa. So essentially, Omni Lance makes it so that all three shelling types work now on every single gun lance. So you don't have to pick and choose, right? Um. So with that, it means basically. <laughs> You know how the other three, like, you know how all three shelling types are supposed to be played normally, right? Oh, uh, what's it called? You have... Why well, doesn't know? Okay. If I don't know, I won't say anything, though. <laughs> Figure it out yourself, then. Get some screamer pods. Okay. I'm actually looking at the documentation toy well. Alright, you do that. Huh. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I need two tails for the gun lance, and I need another two tails for the waist. So we gotta go for those tail cuts whenever we hunt Nergante. Or I just Google it. You're all good. It has wide, long, and uh, normal, I think, of mine. Yeah, basically. Yeah, that's what I love about it so much, though. Because before, you'd have to choose, like, all right, you know, what kind of gun lance style do you like playing? You know, do you like doing the whole charge shelling? Do you like doing burst shelling? Do you like doing just poke, poke, poke uh, explosion? You know, like classic style gun lance, you know? Um, and you have to choose, like, pick and choose, essentially, right? Um, and then you'd have cases where some of them just aren't even competitive in terms of damage at the other ones, you know, et cetera, et cetera. But with Omni Lance, um, you have all three now in, like, on every gun lance, right? And the type of shelling you use depends on how you use the shells now. So, for example, if you do a regular explosion, you do a uh, wide shell now. A wide explosion does more damage on just single explosion, right? Uses two shells. You do a charge shell and everything. It's much longer, like it does long shelling and it's much longer and everything and it does charge damage, uses two shells. And then when you use burst shelling, it uses as a normal shelling type, but every single shell is like, every single blast only costs one shell, like per usual. 
So you see how I have like six shells right now with the magazine thing? Because normally you only have four. When you fire normal, you fire off wide shelling, and it uses two. If you do charge shelling, so it goes further, uses two as well. And then you do the burst, fires every single one single like by itself for a burst shelling. Now, when you do reload and all that, everything is now the it's now a quick reload by default. And the only way to get your worm stick back is to do the full reload, and you do that by doing the back hop into a reload. That one doesn't have a guard point though. Oh yeah, and that's another thing too. The quick reload has a guard point now. <laughs> because why not? Oh, Nova. Oh! <laughs> I needed that, that's why I was mining. <laughs> and do this so we don't ding on. Okay, never mind. Fuck me, I guess. And then fuck you. Ooh. Nice. Come up over here. We're already down here fighting it. Why don't you come here? Huh? It's not all about you, Leon. Door point. You just gotta be careful and figure out the timing, though, because um, it's not the exact moment you do your quick reload. It's a bit after the start. Oh, I was hoping to iframe through that, but ugh. We gotta heal. I forgot to drink my juices. Good stuff, good stuff. Got free mail too on the armor skin, that's nice. Win the raw scaling on shell though and reflect, yeah. Yeah, I I really hope they just bite the bullet one day, get rid of shelling levels, and just make it scale off of the raw. I really hope they do, but... Fuck. Oh. Okay. Slap my cheeks quick. Huh? Good guard there. Good guard. Fuck. Ugh. Really. Man, I'm so used to this gun lance build and everything essentially flinching monsters when I do burst shell. That I'm getting really ballsy thinking, okay, it's gonna flinch them and it doesn't, because again, I don't have the full build here really yet. That's not what I want. Good stuff. don't have uh, shells installed, so we're gonna just do that. Do the back hop reload so we get our worm stake back. Fire off a full magazine right into the head. Oh, he's really hoping he's gonna move his head back quicker, but oh well. Keep firing these at his face, then hopefully Leon can get a knockout easier. Now I'm gonna start working on the tail. Yeah, the addition of the guard point was fantastic, yeah. Oh, Nova! <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> the things we do for mining, you know? Door point. Oh! How cool would that have been if, like, that full burst right there procced all the thorn pods and it got a knockout with it, huh? Would I have been poggers to you guys then? Door point. Nope. Come on, give me that tail cut. You know you wanna. Oh, good stuff. Is he already low? I don't have any tracks on him, so I can't tell. I mean, we could just put down a trap, see? You know, it doesn't hurt. I guess we can also just wait to see if he goes to sleep, too. That works. Alright, it's not low. 
Oh, another huge change too, by the way, Opal. Um, Wyvern Fire is now just one singular shot instead of three different shots. So it is now actually viable for waking up monsters. I thought we killed it, but no. Yeah, we got it just down enough. Perfect. Good shit, y'all. Clean ending. Everybody's mining now. <laughs> When do we fight the Monkey King? What did you like to know? Yeah, because Rajon got added in Iceborne, right? So we gotta wait till then. We got a ways to go, though. Speed sharpening. Ooh. That can be very useful. Especially since we're gonna be having a lot of, like, single slot uh, decos. Rock and stone. We're rich. We're rich. <laughs> I need to play more of uh, Deep Rock. That's a fun game. I guess we could do the investigations one. Do I have any Nergagante ones, actually? I do. Only two faint, though. Hmm. If anybody has a good uh, Nergagante investigation, I'd appreciate it. But if not, we can just do a regular one. Only reason I'm not doing this is because it has two faints. And I'm still pretty squishy, all things considered. Don't sound like that, please. I did not like that one bit, Sam. I am. And we need another Rathalos Medulla here as well. Okay. Okay. Oh no, we only need two tails. What was the other tail from? Oh, it was if we wanted to make the gloves. Okay. Yeah, so I just need two tails then. Perfect. Yeah, we gotta go for the Nergigante tail here. Oh, hello. How you doing, by the way, Bonk? Forgot to ask. Can't wait for season four, yeah. Because that's coming out soon, right? Yeah, how you doing, though, Bonk? Beetlejuice in the field of fire. We gotta do that soon. The Eater of Elders. That is an E-game, yeah. Got one three silver? Yeah, go ahead and post that then. Go ahead and post that one. Because oh, I just need skills and tails at this point. And I think the investigations have a chance to give tails in the uh, rewards, but... See, now that I said it out loud, it's not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, we also want to be eating for sharpshooter if we go with normal build. Provoker to hopefully keep his aggro on me. <sighs> oh. Did you get what you need, by the way, alone? be easier to upgrade the weapon or just make it yeah anything hey. happens it's bear's fault uh-huh uh-huh Ooh, amber deposits too that's actually gonna be really nice to try and get the rare material from that too so you need a large wyvern gem uh okay oh shit we're out of demon drugs Thankfully, we can just make a shit ton of those. And yeah, now we have plenty of these for the time being. We do need to get more adamant seeds and night seeds, though. Killer Kappa? Uh, we'll find out. We'll find out. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, we're going to. I don't really need to do that. 
Yeah, we're not going to keep everything max until we get the fertilizer item. I'm going to do that there, and then we're going to put Bitterbug on hold. We always want honey being made, though. Oh, Elder Dragons can't be killed, so it's kind of obvious. Yeah, that's true. That's pretty true, actually. Good point, good point. You're done? Ooh, what'd you get? You get your things? You get what you need? You get what you need? Oh. And also, while we're here, Leon, you can go grab, uh, do some mining yourself and get that fire cell stone, you know? You got the horn? Hell yeah. Hi. I forgot to grab my demon drug. Feels bad. All right. Well, you can fucking wait. Papa needs to go grab some stuff. Mm -hmm. Grab this. Grab the three mining points down here and the one by the entrance and then get into the fight. Feels bad. No rare thing. Yeah, we still need the amber rare part. I thought that was one right there. Is it actually? Oh, it is. Shit. Just casually burning away. We gotta get that tail cut, though. There's the fire cell stone. This is what uh, Leon should be doing, actually. Because he needs that fire cell stone, from what I remember. I need the Fusium. Okay. Let's get in there. Now, we could have probably went to the camp and grabbed a demon drug too to help, but... Eh. It's just five more damage. It does help, but... And we also got two more Fusi more, too. That's nice. It's definitely nice. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, I'm gonna. <laughs> Says don't tell him what to do when he tries to tell people what to do all the time. I see it. I see what you're doing here. <laughs> Kind of hoping that go into the tail, but oh well. I love the Nergagante theme. Oh shit, hold on. There we go. Casually burning alive while grabbing Amber, as we should. It's the Floridian experience. Oh, I was gonna guard point that, but did it too early. Oh, I technically blocked it. Oh, oh. I guess... Okay, I heard the block go off, but actually, no, it fucking ripped apart my goddamn mantle. <laughs> I wonder if I need guard up for that, then. Or maybe there... Oh, uh, maybe there's a second hit there. I guess it's twice. Fuck. Perfect. Got the mount, good stuff. We're going sharp on here. Oh, he's also throwable too. That's good. I'm gonna try and tenderize the tail again. Hopefully, get some slinger pods. There we go. Get it! Shit, it just hardened. We can cut through it at least, but we gotta break that stuff.
Nice. All right, now we can cut it. Like your cut, G. No, it's not the tail, but... Got me! So there was a thorn pot on there. I thought there was too. I wasn't sure. I'm like, I'm gonna just keep hitting it for quick. Oh, perfect. Perfect. I'm sharpening him. Did two mounts, by the way. Good shit. Do you have like rider on or something? Fire still stone is for two horn by side leggy. Like, yeah, okay. Uh-oh. Rut row raggy. Oh, Wolfie. Not a glider. Ah, uh, fair enough. That glider's pretty good. Okay. My face was funny. You survived the dive? With that dive? Or you mean the first one? Yeah. I guess because you went out of rage, maybe? But. Oh, that went into the wing. God damn it. I was hoping to... Oh, yeah. Skill issue now in your shout out? I swear, y'all so toxic. Y'all so toxic to each other. Not gonna lie, I kind of said I can't join. Uh, so you can't shout my name when I inevitably faint. <laughs> what? Punk. No. <laughs> I always feel bad whenever any of the homies die. You love it? I don't, actually. <laughs> See. Still don't have that tail cut though. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda not gonna do a wake up hit, actually. Actually, no, Wolfie, I want you to do the wake up hit if you can. Um do a dragon piercer shot through the tail. No files? Yeah. I had a feeling. Yeah, if you don't mind, can you try and get a dragon piercer shot on the tail? I'm like thinking like which one of us has the best like wake up attack that does cutting damage, you know? Where is the tail? Oh, it's in the fucking ground. Jesus. There it is. Alright, now we can go. Good stuff. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> wakey, wakey. Good tenderizer. There. I'm glad I didn't send the loon flying. Those, yeah, the earplugs coming from the hunting horn are coming in clutch right now. Definitely coming in clutch. Oh! I was gonna try and iframe that. 
I miss evasion. <laughs> Two rounds hit there. Unfortunate. Oh! There we go. I get stuff. I sure hope I get a Nergaganti gem from here. I mean, we need that too, but. Enough with the scales from these goddamn tails, please. I don't need scales. At least we can make the waste, but. Ugh. Feels bad. Hey, good gems, y'all. Good gems. Two gems? Good shit. Everything will be forgetting when those servers come out? Hell yeah. That's gonna be fun. That's gonna be fun. Especially the fact that, what's it called? The, um... What is it like the better dose patch or whatever too? the better dose mod the one that adds essentially portable style controls to dose they said they're going to be compatible with the translation patch as well that's exciting we did get a tale from the reward though this is why i was like i want to do investigations over a regular quest because then you can get it from the rewards but i was really hoping to get a tale from the cut and then one from the reward oh well oh well Ooh, okay. That's good. At least we can make the waste now. The waste. Yeah, the Dose Plus mod works with a uh, translation, right? I'm very happy to hear that. I don't mind, you know, stick controls. You know, I would have just dealt with it, but... Okay. Why do you need a waste? So the one wave right now gives us the guard that we do want if we're going against like stuff like Behemoth, right? When we go against that, we might swap back to this set. But if we want attack though, we want to go for the waste here. Because attack boost two, plus it has a two slot, meaning we can actually slot like guard up or magazine into this one. All right. Plus it has some really good defense value to it as well. Which is going to definitely come in handy. Oh, we can't even upgrade that yet. Oof. Great this. And the chest piece we're going to be using for a while here. So. I still need another tail, but, you know. I'm not against more grinds. Not gems. The angel legs we're going to be keeping too. Upgrade that. Okay. And decorations. We're going to put the. Where is it? We don't have the guard up one yet. Fuck, I forgot. When do we get that again? Oh no, I think guard up we get in master rank, right? Hold on. No, we get guard up from uh, Xeno Jiva. That's right. Yeah. Land of Convergence. Yeah, so when we do Land of Convergence, that's when we get the guard up deco, and that's where we're going to put it into the uh, gloves here. So for now, we're probably going to do a Vade Extender, actually. I think a Vade Extender could be nicer. So we'll put Magazine in the Waste. Do a Vade Extender there. That all should be super useful here, too. And we're going to get rid of Satiated. And we're instead going to put in... We're going to put in Health Boost just so we can be tank here. <sighs> but Grinder... Uh... Yeah, let's just... Yeah, we'll go with Vitality. Safer. All right, so let's get the next group in. Right back okay all right so we got unknown and then whiff wife 
And again, if you guys would like to join again, you're more than welcome to. Just join in through the join command again. Um, Opal. I know Opal said she'd be right back too, but we'll see. And we got Wolf again. All right, cool. Let's grab you again, Wolfie. Okay. Okie dokie. Welcome back. Perfect timing. So, Rena, continue to have I need the shells. Okay. No worries. Guard up is kind of mastering, kind of or Oregon. Yeah. Well, the uh, what is it? The quest list says we get the deco and everything. The guard up deco from the what's it called? Um, Land of Convergence quest, which is Xenojiva. Are you supposed to get the impact mantle? Covered investigations, HR. Hmm. Interesting. Anything specific someone needs? I mean, I need a uh, Nergigante. I'm going to need Nergigante, uh, Tio, but I don't think I can do Tio yet because I haven't done the cutscene. Um, and then Rathalos, personally, but. That's what I need. Because I need a Rathmadula. I think it's a Rathmadula. I need Rathmadula, then I need another Nergigante tail. And I'm also going to need the gem, too, of, of, like, you know, eventually for the upgrade to that. I just need to farm some Nergigante. I also need regos regrowth plates. Ugh, talking. Yeah. Yeah, and I think this needs, what is it? Nergigante horns, Nergigante gem, and then the Xenojiva part. Because I remember a lot of these final upgrades requiring Xenojiva. I mean, this one doesn't, but yeah. Thank you for the follow, I be doom. I do appreciate it. Hope you enjoy your stay. How you doing, Cryptic? Hope you're having a wonderful day today as well. How is work? So, yeah. That's our goals right now. Today we're going to kind of spend it as like a bit of a farming day instead of mostly progression. Which is fine. Reason why I want to get this high rank set is because, again, we're not going to be going on the mass rank until we... What is it? Um, Until we beat all of the high rank stuff. Which means all the arc tempered high rank monsters. Um, And this also includes the Leshen and the Behemoth stuff too. Okay. So that's why I want to get this set built now so we can have it. Are we going to get into augmenting? Probably not because I really didn't care for the, uh, what is it, base game augment system. I don't know if that's been improved now or not, but I mean, we'll see, I guess. Ooh. Well, that's a spicy investigation right there. Uh, we'll save it. Just two faints, though. Interesting. So, any Davos? No worries. All right, so we got Unknown, Opal, Wolfie, and then me. Let's get in your game. Hmm. Provoker or Acrobat? What a hard choice to make. <laughs> Work was actually pretty chill today. Hell yeah. Unintentional pun again. Oh. Oh, Unknown used the gourmet. Oh. Try to get a lance. No worries. Oh, Alun, you're not in this uh, rotation. Sorry. You're in the last one. <laughs> not to kick you out like that. Sorry. You're more than welcome to join again, though. Um, Just join the queue again, and then we'll get you into another rotation later on. Yeah, no. More than welcome to join again. Just trying to make things fair, you know? I'm still jealous of how good the Demon Lord stuff looks on, uh... Looks on women compared to men. I'm not a fan of the men's, like, Demon Lord set. We'll join, but I'm gonna help Slinky. Hey, no worries. What's Slinky up to? My heart broken, dreams shattered, yeah. Hey, it happens to the best of us. <laughs> Skin cells, uh... Oh, let's bring this because we don't need to trap it. It's up to get Teo Gem and two horns for the artillery three charm, yeah. Yeah, so we just gotta focus the horns then and then the uh I mean that's it really, just focus horns.
She's working on catching up in uh, Rise? Rise or Iceborne, though? That's what I'm curious about. Yeah, no. Had to eat a buff? No, you're good. When we do get to the end, though, of... um, What's it called? When we get to the end of this whole quest line, we are going to avoid using the Gathering Hub because that whole... What is it? The mod I have that lets NPCs show up there? If you talk to the Tail Rider lady before you, like... Like, when the start of the uh, Witcher collab happens... You can completely derail the entire quest line where Geralt never shows up and you can never do it if you do it that way. So, I know we can just simply avoid talking to her when, around that point, but I'd just rather avoid the gathering up just in case. Still none. Oh, I didn't bring bombs, shit. I gotta put bombs into my kit. That's the one thing I'm forgetting. Jesus, <laughs> it blew up everything. Love it. Alright, we'll save the mining for uh, after. Just chug our drinks real quick. Friendly finding Odo. Ooh, spicy. Oh, yeah, because this is. You're using your ice character, right, Slinky? Well, how are you doing, Slinky? I'm gonna say goodbye to this vitality mantle soon enough. Man, I can't wait to. Uh, only reason I can't wait to fight Lunestra, though, is to get the temporal mantle. Come on, let me see that face. Now, should have guard pointed it. We should try and throw it, actually. Oh, never mind. We're gonna do this instead. Oh, Slinky, by the way, with Wolfie's help, found out what they meant by the whole slide reload thing, by the way. So, when you fire off a round, if you have the evade reload mod, when you fire off a round, you need to wait like a second or two and then dodge roll. If you do the dodge roll, then it goes immediately into the slide. If you don't wait a bit after firing, then you have to roll normally and all that. But yeah, thanks to Wolfie, we were able to figure that out. Birds are flying over my head. Nice. That was in base ice one though? What? The whole like shooting and waiting a bit or no? If that wasn't base ice one, then I never knew. And I have no clue what they mean by that then. Oh, I was gonna try and guard point that. Oh! Good hits on the head. Hey bear, what's the name of the Piscine Wyvern that shows up in Elder's Recess? <laughs> what, the Volcanoes? <laughs> yeah, what a trap thing to ask. Like, what a loaded question to ask right there. I have a funny feeling I know exactly what you're going for. I didn't know Crimson. I'll shot you on a bit. I don't have guard up, so I'm not even going to attempt to guard the... Yeah, shit. Come on. There we go. Ah, uh, fuck. Hey, that works actually. That works really well. Thank you for canceling that. Yeah, thankfully, though, the ice mod fixed that and actually renamed it back to Lava Seoth as it should be, though. You know, Crimson?
kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Let's grab this mining and then I'll shout out. <laughs> That's perfect. That's all. Oh, we need all that kind of fusium right there. Perfect. Ooh, another Nova crystal? No, fire cell. Yeah. No. I forget we can just flash the UTO too. This is, this is high rank. Harish, lovely. Yeah, how you don't know, Crimson. And how you doing as well, Slinky? I don't know if I asked you or not. Does the Ice Mod also fix the weapon designs? Unfortunately, no. There was another mod that does that, but it's not compatible with Ice, unfortunately. It's not compatible with Ice. But there's a cool mod that actually brings back, like, old designs and everything and puts them into, like, a world, like, kind of a uh, style, if that makes sense. Like, there's no drumstick, uh, bracky dual blades, you know? Oh, the horn is broken. Good stuff. Hey, guys, let's capture it, you know? Let's capture it, guys. What, what are we doing? Why can't we capture it? Good flash. Gonna try and help with the tail cut here. Ugh, shit. <laughs> unknown gets it. You just didn't place it right, Unknown. That's all. Come on, just change your just just, just change it. Just change the placement. Ooh, damn! Y'all really didn't want him to leave. I respect that. <laughs> yeah, I think you just missed with the traps. That's all. Better luck next time. Yeah, unfortunately though, that mod is incompatible with um with ice. Now. How many tool how many traps you got there, unknown? Oh my goodness. Are these all yours? Chris, I only saw your thing going up. Oh. How many traps are you putting down? You have another mod in place or something? Oh my goodness. Do you have like a mod that lets you place infinite traps or something? <laughs> Alright, what do we got? Got one horn. I still sad about my mod not being compatible, right? It is what it is. You know, I guess killing a Teo would help with the Teo investigation, huh? <laughs> Got three flinch free decos. Nice. Let's go report to ecological research. Spicy set. Very spicy set. Tell me to go to make right. Well, I saw two pitfalls though at the same time, and I was like, "Wait, what?" That's so I was like, con like confused there. Unless somebody else put one down and didn't have an auto shadow for it. Or I just missed it, you know? Oh, pal, what do you want to hunt? What do you want to hunt? That's going to need that. Yeah. Another horn and a gem. Easy peasy. And Sixty percent increased affinity. Bam. Yeah. I remember these being like a must have for a lot of sets back in the day. A lot of latent power here though. I know this was another really good one too.
I could get the TO helmet for lane power, yeah. I mean, that would help with um, stamina depletion when it procs, you know? That would help. <sighs> hmm. Excuse me. <laughs> hmm, Opal is left. All right, that's the quest she wants, huh? I see, I see. I can take a hint. I can take a hint. I'm trying to think of what we can get to replace the Anjanath legs then if we do get that uh, Artillery 3 charm. So let's look at that while we wait for Opal to get back. Wait, we have access to the Dober stuff. What am I doing? Yeah, what the hell am I doing? Yeah, let's just replace the fucking chest piece with the Dober. Yeah. We're broke as hell now, but... Okay, hear me out, right? What we could do... Oh my god. I don't know if I want to do this for the fashion now. Oh my god. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, what's it called? Technically speaking, right? The Rathalos helmet was going to give us two attack, right? Or no. Yeah, it's going to give us two attack. What we could do instead, if we get that artillery level three charm, we replace the engine athletics with this. We're going to look silly as hell with, you know, you know, ass cheeks out and all that and short shorts. But, but, it's going to have the attack 2 boost, which means we're going to have max attack with that. Because we're also getting the... Yeah, we already have the waste here. So we have 6 attack boost with just these 3 parts. And we have the extra, like the 7th one and everything from a level 1 deco slot. So then we can just take the helmet then. And get this. The good old Dragon King one. With the weakness exploit, you know? Is weakness exploit really key for Gunlance? Not really, but it's not bad. Or is get handicraft increase the amount of sharpness we have, but that's not gonna work on the Nergigante stuff actually, so never mind. Could always just wear the glasses too for crit eye, but I think the weakness exploits better here. You can always get this too for flinchery, but eh. Get the Rathian helmet for evade extender. Could just go back to the Baroth helmet for the guard. You know, it's another option. Yeah. So we got options. We got options if we do that. We subject ourselves to the uh, booty shorts treatment, you know? Because we don't have any layered armor here. I, mean, I need so much money for this. Yep. That's why I've been trying to run the uh, bandit mantle, funny enough. Let me actually put that back on. Yeah. So maybe we might go the Baroth helmet. I don't know. Yeah, we have a choice of either damage with the weakness exploit. It's going to give us 30% crit if we're hitting with the blade attacks, right? Or if we go with the Baroth helmet, we go up to guard level 3, which gives us, uh, what is it, 20 effective guard? Yeah, guard power by 20 instead of 10, which is huge. Hmm. Choices. And we could just make one of both. One be like a damage oriented one and one being a more defensive. Okay, done with Odo. Sorry. No, you're good. I need to apologize. Oh, thank you for getting that there, Fred. This monster ever made, right? Oh my god. Crimson. Crimson in her hatred of world. A smitch. By that logic, then, wouldn't that make Frontier one of the awful, like, worst ones ever, then? <laughs> With the version that's out right now? <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Tell trade-ins? I mean, we've been doing that already, but... I think I might only have a couple more right now, personally. Cheeked up Gunlance out? Yeah. The reason I'm confused about the evade reloading is because I don't have evade reloading on my current gun, but I can still do the shoot and then step evade after a second. 
Okay, what do you mean by step evade, though? Because the one I'm talking about is like you shoot and if you wait a second... Here, actually, let me show you. Just so we're on the same page. Because I don't remember this being in the base game, but I might just be misremembering, you know? Like, it might quite literally be just that. So let me go to the training arena real quick. Is it not Thursday already? Hell yeah. I want to say booty shorts. Yeah. So I have a uh, evade reload on this, right? So you know how it does this, right? That's regular evade reload. See? And instead of doing a hop, you do the actual reload there. If you wait a bit. I think that's what they meant in the ice mod changes. If you have the evade reload uh, mod on. So you don't do a hop anymore. You instead do just the actual slide reload. Hopefully that makes sense. Unless that was in the base game already. You know, or like that is in vanilla. And the evade reload mod just reloads your ammo instead of doing the hop. Oh, so that is in vanilla then? So I've never seen that in vanilla. That's why I'm like curious about that. I don't have evading reload and I can still do the hop and slide after shooting. Yeah, that one, right? Well, you normally, yeah, the normally you do the evade like and all that, but you don't do the reload. But I could have swore the thing we were confused about with the ice mod was like when it said, well, let's look at it again. Just we're on the same page, you know? Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, it says now changes uh, neutral unsheathed roll to evade reload slide if equipped. Right. Can I take it off real quick then? Hold on, just so we can really experiment with it. Yes, we can. Perfect. Because again, I'm just trying to make sure understanding it properly, you know, so we can help figure it out. All right, so let's see. Yeah, you just do the slide. You don't do the reload, though. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I think that's what it means, because I don't remember that being possible in vanilla, but then again, I never really tried that too often, you know? Like, I assumed it meant, like, in Rise, how you could just change the switch gun and do the hop and slide without shooting, right? Yeah, I don't think it... Yeah, I don't think it was that. I think it was just more the, uh... Interesting. So if you can do that then. Okay, now all my okay, what? That wasn't happening last yesterday though. Huh? So I know Wolfie was saying to do that, and it wasn't working before either. It's just doing regular stuff. But now all my rolls when going in any direction is just a reload. Interesting. Yeah, so, yeah, all the different rolls now are just the slide reload. To the side, which... Yeah, that's weird, because... Yesterday and everything, on stream and everything, I was even showing Wolfie and... I was doing the regular, like, you had to dodge and then do it twice and everything to do it. Wait, what the fuck? Maybe it has to be aiming? Maybe, yeah. But no, I was aiming last stream too, I believe. Maybe it's just because I was trying to do... I was trying to dodge way too quickly after shooting, yeah. Yeah, I think that's what it essentially means then, by that. How you doing, by the way, Junichi? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Has to be aiming, yeah. And I was aiming too, that's why I was just like, why wasn't it working though, but... Yeah, I guess you just have to wait, but yeah, if you have evade reload, it just seems if you're aiming... Um... And you haven't fired in a bit, you can just do the slide reload immediately. It 
if that helps answer the question. You know? Because, yeah, the wording on that in the uh, mod thing and all that was a bit weird. That's why I was just trying to figure it out, like, being like, what exactly are they saying, though? Yeah, how you doing, though, Junichi? You know, pay me in points. I need the micro approval. Well, who's the one that decided to do the bear girls with a longsword on earlier? Let's go report to ecological research. <laughs> How you doing? I'm vibing. Can't complain. I'm grinding for a gem from Kulu, and it's been unlucky so far. Ah, no worries. I'm vibing though. It's got hope desire since it doesn't win. Yeah, no, I feel that. I'm sorry, I'm with that. It was bugging me a lot. It was bugging me too, but yeah, you can thank uh, Wolfie for that though. You can thank Wolfie for that. But that was weird though, because yesterday I was I was even like just I had it aiming and I tried rolling to the sides and it wasn't doing it for a bit. So I'm wondering if maybe I was in the mud. Does that like change it because of the whole like aqua thing? Is it my turn? Yeah. Hey, we're waiting on you, Opal. What do you want to hunt? Sounds like skill issue. Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. Everybody with their skill issue. Hi, hi, hi. Yeah, whatever you want to hunt, though, pal. Oh, hello. Join. Is there quest up? Oh, okay, cool. I didn't even notice there was a quest up. Perfect. Let's go fuck up a devil Joe. In hey, my bad. Didn't know there was a quest up. Got the gem? Let's go. Got back since I went to the bathroom after my hunts and didn't get to see it. Hey, Wyvern Jim got. Can get my Kulu hammer. Hell yeah. Wish you all the luck. Hell yeah. What was I going to do? I was going to do something here. Okay. Let's get the meat zone. I don't think this is going to work, though, because every single time I try to use any of these meats and everything in this hunt, like against the Devil Joe, Great Jaggers always shows up. Even though this is in the Coral Highlands, there shouldn't be a Great Jaggers here. I feel like there's going to be a Great Jaggers, though. <laughs> Because, you know, just Jagras things. No, Miss Chat. Spicy, spicy. Spicy, spicy. Jolly cooperation. No need for me, just let me use hell. True. Now build the Bonborough hammer. Ooh, spicy. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully you and uh you and Cryptic can make some good progress and ice today. Are you still in low rank? Like when do you fight Odegarin actually? Is it low rank or is it high rank? No, oh, you can fight Odegarin in low rank, yeah. Yeah. Probably shouldn't have brought the armor skin, especially if it has defense down. Oof. Still in low rank, yeah, no worries. No worries. Just curious. Nope, that's not a bandit mantle. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, Wolfie. That was fast. Oh. Goodness gracious. <laughs> How hard does he hit? I don't remember him hitting that hard. I mean, he actually, yeah, Wolfie is. Oh. I was going to say Wolfie is a gunner, but then I know Ice made a uh, gunner defense value changes too, actually. Wolfie. 
He got me in a corner. Ah, uh, yeah, that'll happen. Rip in peace, bud. Where the fuck do I go again? I know where it is. I mean, let me just do this. I could have taken the zipline, actually. That would have been... Actually, would have been faster here. Fuck. Actually, would have made use of the zipline. God damn it. Help is on the way. The girls are fighting. Oh. Oh. I have what is called a skill of shield. Oh, God. Well, that was fast. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah, that double-dose is spicy. My apologies, Fat. Hey, it happens. It happens. You're all good. We Let's run that back again. Let's, go Let's run it back. Research. All good, all good. Oh, I need to capture, yeah, capture some wigglers too. Round two. Fight. <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> comes a new challenger but multiple oh, challengers me. i mean they all have less health anyway so works out that's funny a lot of cash too actually so i'm gonna be using a voucher on this one nobody die <laughs> papa needs his money <laughs> Easy hunt, exactly. Ooh. Ooh, please, Proc. With the carver as well. Oh, this is the one. This is the one. Oh, this is the one. Four horns and a pickle. Yep. One more bayo and I got earplugs level four. Think if I get a deco for it, it'll be perfect. Ooh, oh, that's nice. I always fall way behind these playthroughs. It happens. You got busy stuff to do, you know? So no worries. I mean, like, I don't want to be a bother. I'm trying to just get to HR. I already feel bad for cryptic for helping me. No, you're all good. You're all good. No need to feel bad. Besides, it's just an excuse to hang out with you, you know? It's a good excuse to hang out with the Slinky. Plus, you get to hang out with Cryptic, too. It's a good time, you know? It's fun for the whole family. You picking up what I'm putting down? <laughs> Turf War. Wait, what? Oh, it's over there. I'm like, with what? <laughs> right, you two have fun, though. One of the best things of Monster Hunter World is, uh, community is people are always happy to help. Exactly. And that's one of the reasons why I love doing rotations on stream and everything, too. Not only do people get a chance to do what they need and all that, but also, uh, what's it called? Like, even if I don't need those particular parts in that moment, I'm sure I will eventually. And so helping people out will always, like, help me out in the future, too. It's like, I know he's gonna do, or she's gonna do a little roar and everything. Uh-oh, well, this is awkward. Yeah, so my... Wow. My Wyvern Fire went up by, what, about 18 damage with that? Interesting, with Bombardier. I kind of want to throw the regular Diablos. Into, oh, okay, that one just got mad. Here, I'll just run it then. And then... 
Hold this for me, too. Oh! I do want that tail, though. So, you know, we're going to do this. Because old habits die hard. <laughs> do I need to be tenderizing? Not really. It's just need, you know. It's more damage. I threw poo at you. You are legally required to leave. You can leave. There's the door. Oh, shit. Oh, that hit. Hey, that hit. Oh. 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 Thought I thought booty cut. Uh oh. Oh. Stop shooting me, please. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> I think Wolfie was trying to wake me up there, which I do appreciate, but I'm like, I gotta move. <laughs> oh. I threw poo at you. Why are you still here? I'm just gonna throw this out. Throw more poop. No on, get out of here. A filthy animal. Oi, look at me. Nope, that hit the head. Perfect. Wait, what broke? The horns were already broken there. Can't use the screamer pod. So yeah. Yeah. So if I can get into the guard point from that. Spicy. Monster community is just the most I want to help you type of community. If they're struggling, there's always someone to help you. It's always unfortunate, too, when the community gets toxic. That's why I always try to curb the toxicity, especially here. I'm all for jokes, you know, and I don't want it to be like, oh, nobody can joke with each other, but... That's why I keep saying over and over again, the only time pe I allow, like, the skill issue joke and everything is if it's towards me. Because that's one thing. Towards other people, though? No. You guys gotta quickly knock that off. That is not tolerated. Wakey, wakey! Or, I'm not really wakey, wakey, more just... Die, I guess. <laughs> Alright, cool. Wah, 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 wah. There's always jokes, and if somebody's obviously not comfortable with the joke or doesn't care for it, then, you know, just knock it off. All that jazz. Wait. Pickles coming here? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, brothers. We got a pickle on the way. Oh, hold on. Do I change that up? I prefer if you do, personally. Because I can definitely see, like, somebody who doesn't know that you're joking and all that, taking that serious. Please do. I'd appreciate it. Oh, yep, there's pickle. I guess you can really say we're in for a pickle, huh? <laughs> oh. Yeah, if you're not an LS main, you're so... Oh my god, stay toxic. <laughs> oh, don't you eat that corpse. Don't you eat that corpse. I spit it out. You didn't earn it. Just trying to grapple anything here. Oh, there we go. I want to throw him into a wall. Oh, good stuff. I guess that works. I don't know if this is going to reach, but here's an open. Hey! Will it reach her? We're doing the slashing attacks more than explosions because we want to try and do as much cutting damage as we can. I think the worm stake does cutting damage, funny enough. 
At least I remember it's been cutting damage, but. Ooh, ooh. Yo! What are what even are the weak spots for bow? Good question. Wish I could tell you. I do wish I could tell you. Ooh, good hit there. slide there devil joe saliva ah, i was hoping the tail would swing back right into it they're trying to go for those that's on here oh there's regular regular blows Good stuff, good stuff. Oh, hi. Hi, Diablos. That didn't even hit anything. Uh-oh. I was going to throw them into each other, but that works. Enjoy the show. Dude. <laughs> what the suplex. Devil Joe does look like a magnet spike main, to be honest. You know? Makes sense. I love how Devil Joe has turf wars with almost everything, too. It fits so much. Good stuff. Fuck, we got hit with the fence down. We have to be careful now. Oh, good tail cut. Let me throw it again. Nice. Nice. Oh, it's already dead. Oh. All right. Cool. Perks of doing a multi-monster hunt. A lot less health. <laughs> my nickname is Dread Queen Rastion because I'm beautiful and toxic. Oh my goodness. Got all the monsters are super weak to parry, yeah. There you go. Glad we had to stock. Theo <laughs> skill issuing me, yeah. <laughs> Red Queen is just plain toxic though, yeah. Diablo Sarns. Mm -hmm. No, I love the what is it? The Rajong versus uh Devil Joe uh turf war in Master Rank. It's so cool. It's so cool. So I can get that up before I get hit. Oh, we still have defense down. That is not good. Like the was just stole my cat. It happens to the best of us. It's like, is that gonna destroy the trap? I swear that was a thing back in the older games too. The Elvis being able to just destroy traps. Should be going for the wings actually.
Ooh. Good paralysis. Good kill. Good kill. Brought two large wyvern gems. Why can't I get the slug for items I need? <laughs> it happens. Alright, GG's, y'all. Them adding element status to the stake is fun. Oh, yeah. Again, I love so much, like, so many of the changes that came with um, the ice mod and everything, especially the whole just... Wait, do we actually have the unique item or the rare item here? Oh, God, I don't remember. Um, What's it called, though? I love all the changes they've done to really make element much more worth using in this game, especially element and status. Like, the whole greatsword changes. I keep going back to greatsword, but... oh. I love that new element greatsword combo you can do. 27,000. Perfect. Yeah, that was some nice cash. Thank you there, Opal. And a silver crown. Yeah, that was a pretty big Diablos. Not a gold crown, though, Mezzi. I swear. Even in this game. We have enough data on the wildfire waste now. Right, cool. Let's go report to ecological research. Good hunt, y'all. All right, next quest is going to be Wolfie. Going to be next. Get that one. Okay, but I'm going to use the bathroom, so I'll be back in a bit. See you guys soon. Don't, don't go anywhere. Full Diaper Alchemist.
full diaper alchemist. Okay, we're back. We're back. Uh, yeah, unknown. What's it called? Yeah, if you're already in the rotation, then, uh, try to avoid people rejoin the queue until... What's it called? <laughs> After they've left and all that jazz. Ooh, excuse me. Just to make it fair. All that, you know? Alright, let's see. So... Wolfie, do you have your quest on? You do. Perfect. Da, 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 da. Ooh. Oh, we gotta get you those uh, other camps, bud. We gotta get you those other camps. Polisher and acrobat, please. Okay, I'll just take polisher. That'll do, I suppose. Where's Opal? Opal! Where's she at? What was the other item I was saying I should add to my kits too? Bombs. There we go. Bombs. We need bombs. Okay. King Shot Gajalaka is very big. Oh, yeah. So what we need then, we need more of those. So we're going to let those go. And then we need to start getting some Devil's Blight. Because this is what's going to allow us to get those large barrel bombs, or the mega ones. Which, speaking of, we need gunpowder. we got plenty to make gunpowder. Yeah, we've been gathering a lot of the fire herbs, thankfully. Just need large barrels. So we definitely want to start bringing our own barrel bombs. So let's do that. Let's buy with our newfound wealth that'll be gone very quickly. <laughs> I feel like it's just better to just buy the bombs. Like, it's slightly more expensive, but it's going to save on materials. We just made some gunpowder. Let's do this instead because we need to save money. Okay, so with that being done, now we're going to go over here. This. And this. Okay, cool. Alright, you guys ready to go kick some ass? Just trying to keep in mind that no worries. No worries. Stay hydrated. This is a threat. No worries. Stay hydrated. <sighs> yeah. I just do that trying to keep things as fair as possible in case other people want to join last second, you know? All good though. Exposed monster. Please don't expose the monsters. Whoa. Those two being lucky to spawn next to the monster while we gotta huff it. How could you, Wolfie? How could you not have these other camps done already? <laughs> Drop this. 
cancel them on Twitter. Oh my goodness. Do hop do. I think we just gotta do that for a while now. Like uh whenever we're in the elders recess, just make sure we're mining. <laughs> he and his husband have kids. Yeah. Well, it happens. Too bad. So sad. Too bad. So sad. What can you do? He ate his husband. Oh. Where's the caring skill in world? Um, Capcom, please. <laughs> My face was funny. Ooh, regrowth plate. Perfect. Good mount. I know it's already tenderized, but I was like, eh, I don't want to get in there too. Wait, oh my, I can really get knocked out of my swipe? Wow. I keep thinking I have much more super armor on a lot of my moves from other players than I do. <gasps> Now we gotta break these horns. Come on, you don't need them both. There's one. Perfect. Wash no nawa kira yoshikage, nende sanju sansai. Jitakua moriocho, hoktov no beso chitai niari, kekkon wa shite inai. What was cringe there? Hello? What was so cringe there? Or did Doodle John just want the price to go up? <laughs> All right, we got our second tail. Thank God. I was worried that's gonna be a much harder grind. Da 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 Good stuff. Good stuff, everybody, for helping break the stuff, too. I do appreciate it. Oh, I forgot to drink my drugs. You hurt my monsties on? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Me and the known are like, no, 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 kill it. Kill it. Hey, good, good, good fucking kill there. Good stuff. Yeah, I'm glad I added the bombs to the list now. To the loadout. Good stuff, y'all. Comments would have been better wake up? Yeah, probably, but... Hey, still, though. All good. Ooh! <gasps> Ooh. So we can make the gun that stab. Ooh, we're getting a nice upgrade. <laughs> Your gun has whoops. <laughs> all good. All good, all good. Hey bear, do you like to eat sand by no reason whatsoever? N no. I can't I can't say I, I do enjoy eating sand. Not to burst your bubble there. <laughs> uh, da, da. <clears throat> I 
Okay. All right, cool. We got some more regrowth plates. That's good. But only... Actually, we needed two horns, right? I could have sworn we needed two horns, unless I'm thinking about Teostra. I know we needed two Teostra horns, too, but I could have sworn we needed more Mergigante horns. And this is two of them right there, so that's good. I could have sworn we needed two of those as well, though. For what, though? Ooh, Silver Crown. We're talking about the weird shit we do as kids, oh boy. How you doing, by the way, though, Carrot? We have enough data on the wildfire waste now. Let's go I don't know if I've asked you or not today. Research. But we gotta do a little something because somebody activated Cringe Block again. <laughs> and before one day, Cringe Block costs just as much as a mic as approval. And there's legends that go around the stream like, There once was this redemption called the Cringe Block. <laughs> It used to be so funny for the memes, but now it is no longer attainable. The price has gone too high. <laughs> Feel good having breakfast. Ooh. What do you got for breakfast today? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can make it. We're just broke as hell, but we've been getting a ton, a ton of uh, shinies though to sell. Thanks to other people using uh, Bandit Mantle. I do appreciate that. Ooh, good stuff. How much was the cringe block originally? 2,500. <laughs> and it's now 7,250. Yeah, I think the rule set I have right now is that if it's used like two or more times a stream, it goes up by 250 points each time after like the second one or after the first one, yeah. <laughs> right, yeah, so now we need... Yeah, we needed five horns. That's what I was thinking of. We needed five Nergigante horns. The Nergigante gem and then Xenojiva. I think that's a claw or a horn or some shit. <clears throat> but dude, look at this damage jump from 160 to 200. We have the same shelling level, so we're not going to be doing as much. Like, we're not going to be doing better blast damage, but for like cutting and doing other stuff, though, that's great. And then we also have element, too. And then, yeah, what, uh, what Unknown was saying earlier, too, what's it called? The worm steak and everything also has elemental scaling now, if I remember correctly. Yeah, worm steak canning. Let's see. Yeah, so the thrust doesn't have any part break modifier to prevent um, flinching, which is really great. But the part break modifier on the worm steak cannon itself is actually much higher. It used to be a 0 0.3 value. Now it's one, like a full one multiplier. <clears throat> and then it even got element and status modifiers of 30%. So, 30, so we're going to essentially be doing four dragon and everything per tick on each hit. And let's see, since we're at shelling level 5, the motion value is going to be 13. Yeah, so we're doing 13 motion value per hit. Let's do some quick math here, right? Let's see, motion value, 200 times... 13%. So that's 26 damage and everything, but that's also not counting like the hit zone multiplier and all that, yada, yada, yada. So, yeah, we can be hitting for pretty decent numbers every single hit. How many times does it hit again? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, and the final explosion has fire damage too on top of it, so. If I get an Apocryphy Mantle, ooh, that's a very good point there, Unknown. See, now you got to try that. <laughs> now you have to try that. It's true, he is cringe. I am cringe. I am the quintessential, the quintessential cringe of the universe. <laughs> um, Well, now that we have the Gun Knights, I can still use Nergigante stuff, but I can also use... Tio. Um, unknown, can you post that Tio investigation again, if you don't mind? Unless you're saving it for yourself. If you are for something else, then no worries. But if you don't mind posting again, can you please? That was a good one. <clears throat> Wait, we have a deco slot in our chest now. Why aren't we making... Why aren't we taking advantage of that? 
We don't have any three-star decos, though, unfortunately. Um, what do we want in here? We have footing, but we don't really need that. I'm kind of tempted to go all in on Invade Extender, actually. You know, fuck it. Yeah, let's go Invade Extender. We're going to be one mobile-ass goddamn gun lance. <clears throat> I also love the way the Nergigante weapons look, too. I love their designs so much. Especially the Ruiner Nergigante stuff. That stuff looks so sick. Excuse me. Thank you, thank you. I do appreciate it. Vade one is as big as the difference from base and none to one, right? Uh you mean evade window? Or do you mean evade extender from one to three? Right. I don't. I don't remember what the uh, frame values of that are. Actually, that's a good point. Is it seventeen max, just like rise, or no? Oh, extender. Oh, that I have no idea. <clears throat> That I have no idea. Or beef and vegetable soup. Both ladies barbecue chips this time. Ooh. Nice, nice, nice. Extend your evade. You won't. Have you tried a bow yet? Yeah. Yeah, we tried a bow. Um, We haven't really made a bow build, though. But I do want to. Because we tried it out when we first started this playthrough. Um, And it was pretty fun. But we were burning through stamina like crazy. So if we keep farming Nergigante and we have spare parts, I don't mind building the Nergigante chest piece and gloves, actually. Because that would work really well for a bow set. <clears throat> We'd probably have to rebuild the waist though and get the alpha waist though to get the bow. To get like a good bow set going there. Because the chest waist and gloves have like stamina surge, agitator, and attack up. So and those are perfect for a bow. Yeah, I kind of want to make a, like, we're going to really start delving into, like, building a bunch of different sets and everything when we get to Mass Rank. Um, but right now, I'm, like, kind of focusing on the, oh, Jesus. Well, we got the Ancient Ember. Hell yeah. <laughs> Look like a fucking maniac there, though, with the speed gathering. <laughs> yeah, like, right now, we're kind of focusing on Gunlance and then after that Charge Blade, because a lot of the Gunlance skills also translate well into Charge Blade, you know? So we're going to be playing those two for a bit here, and then uh, I do want to try Bow more later. I need these horns. Gord point. Oh, and fun fact, because we have a Nergigante weapon with Elder Seal, that means we can technically actually seal up uh, some of these there dragons. Now let's do this. <clears throat> I was hoping I could get the blast off and trade. Glad I blocked that. Ugh, damn it. Thought that wasn't going to explode that soon. Yeah, we're barely getting any hits in. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa, bad kitty. Oh, I'm sorry we didn't get it by that. I'll take it. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Didn't hit that. Nice. Nice. 22 damage. I'm gonna guard point that. And we should be safe through the rest of the fire blast because we blocked it already, technically.
Oh man, my damage is skyrocketing with this upgrade. I should have held the uh, quick reload. Could have guard pointed that. I'm surprised I didn't get hit by that. I should have. Oh man, that Evadix in there is so nice too. Helps with our mobility. Yeah, so I guess Evadix Center would be a nice comfort skill to have for uh, Conlance too. Really wouldn't want to get Part Breaker on top of that. So like some must-haves I'm thinking of. Because Attack Boost is nice. You don't really need it though because it doesn't, you know, your Blast Damage doesn't scale off your actual damage. So it's a bit redundant there. Especially crit stuff. But if you're doing poke attacks too, that's good. Uh, but what's it called? Uh, Evadix Center would be nice. Having Max Artillery is even better. But we can't get the Artillery Secrets like skill and all that until we get to Raging Baraki, from my understanding. Either that or Zora Magdros, I think, in, like, the ma Mass Rank set, I think. I'm trying to remember. I remember seeing, like, on the wiki, it said, like, uh, Raging Bracky and then Zora Magdros had it, but this, like, what is that? High rank Zora Magdros doesn't have, uh, Artillery Mastery. Sir. So, yeah, we gotta wait till Raging Bracky before we can get Max Artillery, which is fine. We'll make it work. Ugh. Had a Vade Extender coming in clutch. What does Elder Seal do? So if you're against an Elder Dragon, uh, what's it called? All Elder Dragons have like their Elder Form or some shit like that, right? Elder Seal is essentially like an invisible gauge that you can build up over time. And then when it procs, you essentially kick him out of their mode. It's so like Teal, for example, if he's building up his, uh, like if he's building up to his uh, Nova Blast, for example, if you do an Elder Seal on him, all the flame from like his body will disappear and then he gets, you know, he gets kicked out of using his uh, Nova. It's a, it's a weird mechanic, I'm not gonna lie. Like pretty gimmicky too, but there's some cases where it can really come in the clutch or come in clutch. Ah. Did we break the horns? I think we did. Good stuff. I was going to try and throw him there, too. But yeah, because we have some form of Elder Seal now, and it's actually high, that means if we keep hitting a monster over and over again, we have a pretty good, like, uh, way of breaking them out of their form. Oh, That's Jesus. Of the Elder in the waste. I know it's enough of that, but I'm trying to get research, research levels. People. Unless it doesn't even count for research levels. Okay, well, obviously he's angry, even though it doesn't show as angry. I think he was trying to leave the area. I know if a monster is enraged and all that, even though it says like it's not enraged on the map, um, usually means they're trying to leave. Four point, yeah. Kicks the monster out of rage, aka elder mode, yeah. Not rage exactly, but yeah, kicks them out of their like fancy mode. Kind of what uh, Fried saying though. Like what is it for Valhazak example, right? Um, Valhazak does the whole like has that coating of effluvian that really starts to burn quickly, you know, even more than usual. If you get enough Elder Seal on that, it just makes it dissipate and kicks him out of that form. And you got stuff like that. So it's an, I like the idea of it, you know, but I don't know. It feels gimmicky to me though, personally. It felt gimmicky to me, but I do like the idea of being able to like kick him out of their like Elder stuff or their Elder ability or whatever. When we got the other horn, we still don't have the gem, but... Oof, excuse me. We'll get it eventually, I'm sure. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, with the end of the rotation, let's grab the next two people in. If you guys would like to join again, though, you're more than welcome to. Just be sure to join the queue. So we gotta get Leon and Loon in here. Loon. Oh, got Wolfie. I'm gonna leave that there then. 
Okay, you guys are allowed to join again at the end of the rotation. Um, second. Just checking something real quick. One second. No, no, yeah. Right. Let's get Wolfie out of there. Oh, excuse me. Uh, what's wrong? What do you want to hunt, bud? If you don't have anything particular you want to hunt, you can always just choose to skip it and I'll just take your turn, but... If I take your turn, I'm just going to take it for, like, either Tio or Nergigante. <laughs> this guy sounds drunk. I'm not going to lie. <clears throat> so what does Devil Joe have? Anything good? He's got Heartbreaker and Handicraft. That's nice. What was the leg I was thinking about making, too? Was it the Dover leg? Yeah. I won't wear it now yet, but... The Dover leg is actually pretty good, too, with the Stamina Surge there. Hmm. It's easier to make too. We just wouldn't have the Nergigante hunger though bonus if we go with that. Actually, no, we still would actually. Yeah. What am I saying? Yeah, all that'll do is actually just make it so we don't have to make um yeah, we don't have to make the waste again. So we can keep this, still have the Nergigante hunger. Keep the uh yeah, just use the alpha boots and everything if we put together a bow build. And then just get these two. Does that make it we have a uh, level three stamina surge? We'd have level 3 Agitator. And then level 5 Attack Boost. With just that. And then we have the Helmet Slot open as well. And I figured for the Charm, we can have the Bow Skill there. Because so I'm assuming there's a Bow Skill for the Charm, right? Or... We can get the legs and everything. These ones... Oh, that doesn't have Surge, so... Hmm. Increases the attack power of normal ammo and normal arrows, right? But what is it? You actually want the... What is it called? Special ammo one, right? <clears throat> Increases Dragon Piercer and Thousand Dragons. So what's Dragon Piercer and what's Thousand Dragons? And I think I'm getting them mixed up now. Hmm. I don't know then. What's happening, chat? No skip? No skip? What do you mean? Like you're not skipping? If you're not skipping, no worries, but... Just confused what you mean. <sighs> Howdy, Alun. <clears throat> Whose turn is it? It's Leon's. It's Leon's. Do I have enough to make the... What's it called, actually? I know I don't, but what do I need? Just three more mortal skills, huh? Okay. All that we're waiting on is just getting that artillery charm upgrade. Because if we can get that... If we can get that, we can then swap to this. Put on the Dober pants here. Yeah. That'd be great. <clears throat> Dragon Piercer is the charge up piercing shot? Right. So what's the thousand dragon sun? What's that? Thousand dragon is the version you do with the slinger mode that you can do by clicking the thumbstick. There's a, wait, there's a second dragon piercer? I didn't realize you can upgrade it with a clutch or slinger ammo. Interesting. I didn't realize there was. Okay, that's cool. Need slinger ammo though, right. Now does the slinger ammo change like the effect of it or no? 
Like, if you use different slinger mounts, does it change the effect of it, or is it just like you just need anything? It does? Ooh, interesting. How? Tell me. She already said it right there. Just scroll a bit up. <clears throat> Changes based on the type of the slinger. Ooh, that's sick. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that was a thing. Anyone got two, three, four, five bronze leggy low rank investigation? A bronze one? <clears throat> nope, I only got high rank. That's really good rewards, just shitty conditions though. One faint and only two players max. Feels bad. I only got high rank uh, leggy. Oh, this one's not bad though. Ugh. These are awful Nergigante ones, huh? No Tio though. Because I can't get uh, Tio investigations though until um, kill it. Okay. Guess I can't get those until I actually do the story thing for it. <clears throat> at 231 true attack oh that's nice that's nice and now technically you know with attack boost especially when you get to master rank it's better to just get to level four and that's it for the affinity you know having more attack boost is always nice but it gets into one of those, like, the more you get away from the beginning of the game and you go into the further parts of the game where numbers are higher, you want to go for percent stuff instead of just, you know, flat value. All right, like, let's get the kill stuff because we're killing it. All right, where's the loon at? A loon. Where, oh, where is our loon? It's one of my favorite moves for it, really. But since I use bow a lot in the base game, I'm trying to not use much here, right? No worries. Coming? All right, no worries. Just making sure you're still here. Howdy. Did you get all the Diablo stuff you needed, by the way? Still in the same charge plate, I see, huh? Oh my. Oh me, oh my. keyboard mouse you might have to see what the controls then say in like the top right if you still have that up i should have killed one i cap uh Get all this free ammo. You best bet I'm taking it. Yeah, you need your schlinger stuff. Did you do it? Man, Wolfie's using their ammo again. <clears throat> all right, let's see. These. Of course, Legiana's up there. God forbid, Legiana comes straight here. 
<clears throat> Gotta find it in that god awful area. Ugh. Come on, let me up. Give me up, he's. Let me up. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> So you said kill this thing, huh? Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Oh, ow. Rude. Oh, Ooh, thought I missed that. I might. Let me up. Nope. Other one. Oh, other one. And rise the tail so we can break it quicker. You want the wing? Oh, okay. You want the wing? Okay. <laughs> Your point. Something broke. I don't know what it was though, but something broke. That wing's broken. Ooh. I actually can't tell what's broken and what's just uh, tenderized. I'm not that hurt. Something broke again. Oh. What are we doing up there? Okay. I think we need to go for his left wing. I think that one's just tenderized, whereas the right one is broken. It's kind of hoping that'll knock it out. Ugh. Knock it out of the air. I'm the go. Wee. Yahoo! I know you have to swap clutch con and use the dragon piercer input, right? Yep, shit. Kinda hit the wing. Ugh. Oh, still hit. Damn, let's really open that knock it out of the air again. All right, everybody, get ready for the climb. Unless you guys came prepared with the air mantle. <laughs> I love that. Whenever somebody misses like a clutch call, you just see a little grabby hand come out. It's the funniest too whenever you see like a uh, what's it called if you ever see a monster running away and all the players are trying to clutch onto it They like get it to stop you just see a bunch of grabby hands being like hey, come here <laughs> I love that shit so much especially in the guiding lands. It's just so funny All right, I'll wake up the I'll wake up with the wing break With a uh, wyvern fire I think it was his left one that still needs to be broken right so the right one's broken. Yeah, Need to break his last one. All right. Wakey, wakey. Didn't break. God damn. God dang.
Okay, I was like, how are you not dead yet? Did we break it at the last second? No, it's just tenderized. Shit. Well, it's broken already? Is it? Because the other wing has, like, the tip broken. I thought it was just tenderized there. Okay. These wings don't actually look separately breaking? Okay. So you mean, like, how this one, like, the tip of it's, like, actually chipped off. This one won't look the same? Because I thought this one was just tenderized. That's why I was like, oh, yeah, it is broken. Never mind. Okay, cool. Never mind, then. Interesting. Yeah. Not gonna lie, I, w I sometimes struggle with figuring out, like, is it broken or is it just tenderized, you know? <laughs> oh, yeah. <clears throat> and I was looking for that, uh, the tip of the wing there. That's good to know, though. Keep that in mind. Hi. H hi. Hello, ma'am. Ma'am? Oh. You got a little aggressive there. Who would ever want to hit little old me, you know? I'm just a, I'm just a little guy, goofy guy, quirky guy. Excuse me. What level do the Palicos get up to in this game? I don't remember. Is it 99 or no? Is it like 70? We have enough data on the wildfire waste now. Is it 50? No, I think 50 was the base game, right? I really don't remember. really don't remember. I still need to get the ice proof mantle and then a good jow. Guy jow? I don't know. What does have a separate thing? Here, let's go check it ourselves. Uh, Luna, it's your turn, by the way. Whatever you want to hunt. Let's test it ourselves. Do we have... No, we don't. Okay. My cat is 50? Right. So it might be 50 then. Maybe 30 was the base game then. Hmm. Okay, so you have that, right? And you have regular dragon piercer. And then you aim with the clutch claw doing that. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's so much faster. Hello. Oh, my God. 123 damage. Holy shit. And again, this is not a great bow either. That's a little nutty to me. Like a shotgun burst at the point. Shit. That's sick. <laughs> That's sick. I did not know that was a thing with bow. Again, I haven't really touched like fifth gen bow like at all. So I didn't even know that was a thing to begin with uh, in Iceborne. That's sick. That's really cool. Yeah, thank you for the heads up there, Slinky. Yeah, so Wolfie, uh, when you're aiming and everything, what's it called? when you're aiming uh, your bow and all that, there should be a button you hit to bring out the clutch claw while you're aiming the bow. And then it switches to your clutch claw aim. Uh, switch to that and then hit the dragon piercer. Uh, what is it? Controls. An experimental, I believe they made dragon pierce faster. Wait, faster? That's already fit. Like, that's already fast as is, though. That's already plenty fast. Jesus. That was one of my favorite weapons in the world. I'm always happy when people use it. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I think I'm just going to wait till either we get to the part where we're just kind of grinding out sets for high rank to deal with all the arc tempered stuff or um, we wait till mass rank to put together a bow build. We'll see. That's a... Okay. Ooh, that's good money too. Good money, good money, good money. <laughs> no cap, just kill. Okay. Like, no cap, just kill. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it's a bit short range, which makes sense, right? That's fine, though. Thousand Dragon is great when you boost Part Breaker. Ooh. 
That's a good point, actually. Here, let's look up the ice, like, patches, like, patch stuff. Does it have anything about the uh, Dragon Piercer damage? Because I know no one known was saying in the experimental, but... Yeah, Dragon Piercer is now Sever. So wait, another thing I'm thinking about then, too. Because the damage type of Pierce, Dragon Piercer is now Sever, that means it has Blade, like, actual Sever damage zones then, right? Like, when it actually hits damage zone, right? So I know it means, like, now it's cut, like, it does cutting damage, but that means, like, for example, if the head is, like, you know, very strong against, like, shot type damage, but then really weak to Blade Master, if you just kept spamming Dragon Piercer on the head, you'd be doing crazy damage then, right? That's cool. I don't see any changes to the thousand pier like thousand dragon one. Okay. That's fair. I don't want to have left for work, just stop by to say almost oh, good to see you. Hopefully work's going well for you, Acorn. Hope work's going well. Bow dashing definitely is a hard place to pick up, but was one of my favorites on Vanilla World. Right. Isn't that how it's basically played in um, Sunbreak now, almost exclusively? That's kind of one of the reasons, though, why I kind of stayed away from it, because it seems a bit intense on the hands and all that jazz. Because I only know, like, old gen, like, bow, just kind of, like, charge it up and shoot with, like, some power shots added in, you know? All I know is how to eat hot chip and do crime. <laughs> All right, so let's go now from these two seeds. We have plenty of those for now. And let's start getting Devil's Blight so we can start making more of those bombs. And then... And then we're going to do... Two more God Bugs. We can use more God Bugs right now. Can use plenty of those actually. And we can, yeah. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just raise everything to max. Do we need everything max? No. But are we gonna? Yes. This way we don't have to worry about this for 20 quests. Or about 20 quests. I think with our harvest box the way it is, we actually might have to grab it a bit sooner, but it'll tell us if it gets full. We actually see the fuck. We missed the Argosy. God damn it! Ugh. Murder that horny shit in coral blood. No warm blood. You hear me? All right, all right, all right, all right. Usa, usa, usa. No soft soil. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta get soft soil soon. I need to do my optional quest, but I really want to get these like armor sets out first before we go back to doing optionals. At least we have money right now. Very glad about that. Work is pretty good. It's Friday Eve after all. That's true. That's true. They are goosey. Yeah. Sign the contract. Oh my. Dragon Pierce has always been Sever. I mean, says here it's changed to Sever. Yeah, Dragon Piercer. Damage type changed to Sever. It was shot. Yeah. I've had people tell me that in a uh, world and everything like oh, yeah, it used to be sever before but then it says here in the notes It got changed to sever with ice So that's why I'm like Are you sure? I'm not sure now. I know in Sunbreak. Um, what is it? Bo has a move and everything you can use to cut off tails, right? Mine is a spread one now. Ah, okay Dragon Pierce can cut tail without ice. That's good to know. Well, that's good to know. Let's see. Alright. Did I eat? We'll find out. I guess it might be using damage type of ammo. What do you mean? 
What do you mean by that? Because again, I'm not too familiar with how 5th gen bow works and all the jazz. Just from my understanding and all that, the patch notes say they changed the uh, Dragon Piercer to now do sever damage. Do we have this? Fuck, I don't remember. Oh, we have it now. Oh, we didn't. Okay, perfect. I guess we don't have the uh, Wild Spar Waste ones. So we need to look for the other flower, though. There we go. Piercing has always been able to cut tails, which is usually pretty difficult. Right. Like you can cut tails with piercing mods? Right. So wait, you're okay, are you talking about the thousand thousand dragon thing then with pierce pods? Or you just mean just like the dragon piercer as is? Or are we talking about something else then? Just to clarify. <laughs> so in that case, then yeah. I guess they just changed it all to severable, like sever damage then. Instead of uh, shot damage that can cut tails, you know? Maybe that's what Unknown meant, but... Uh... Just Dragon Pierce where I am. Okay, cool. That's good to know, then. That's very good to know. Hey, stop it. Oh. Ah! Oh, we did forget the whoopsies. And I was just pissed. Better be pissed off than pissed on, am I right, fellas? Oh, shit. That causes tremors? Yep, I'm like, yeah, it's fucking hell. <laughs> Forgot that shit, those tremors. That sucked. And because we already took some damage there. Man. Oh, well. Hey, insurance. <laughs> it's not going to work because we already used it, but... Mm -hmm. Oh, she doesn't have that camp. Oh god. Dragon Piercer was uh before it was piercing shot damage, which is capable of cutting tails is just difficult. Right. So changing it to slicing damage makes it easier to cut. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. That's good to know though. That's very good to know. Yeah, I want to try Bell more. It looks fun. Definitely looks fun. What the time? Help is on the way. Oh. Imagine the fucking burn marks, though. Because if I switch to the Dober uh, pants, right? I'm going to essentially be wearing booty shorts. That shit's going to hoit. <laughs> that shit's going to hoit. Can I wrap on, please? I was really hoping it was going to flinch him. Oh, we got a mount and... Okay. It's like, what is happening here? Eh, fuck it. Let's just send it. Oh, this is awkward. I like the sound effect that's there. You guys heard that? Come on, give me that tail. You don't look too happy.
Get him here. Come on. Ugh. I'm going to sleep. I think you're going to sleep. Wasn't done yet. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh. I think he knows we're still here. I think we should just fight. That's cool. Yeah, if you guys have any other tips for bow, then I'd love to hear it. Y'all are making me want to just build that bow set now. We just might. Oh. Yeah, I don't mind taking a few days just to do like builds and all that. Because again, we're gonna be probably spending a but like a bit of time in um in high rank too, because I don't want to move on the mass rank until we get rid of all the like kill all the arc tempered monsters, then do the behemoth, then the what is it? Extremeth and all that. And also kill Extremeth and then the Leshen fight and then the Ancient Leshen fight, you know? And the H Ancient Leshen fight is a fucking bitch and I have to do. <laughs> God, I have nightmares of that shit still. Now, oh, fuck. I still have nightmares of the Ancient Leshen fight. Every single random and everything I tried to do that with back in the day, none of them, none of them wanted to use the fucking, the Igni symbol, or the Igni sigil and all that. I'm just like, guys, please. It's how we survive, please. I think in order for me to beat that on my PlayStation account, I just had to go back to it solo with Master Rank here. And I hated that, but it is what it is. You know? Just hoping to get a tail cut with that. So that's gonna be fun to do. I think he knows I'm trying to go for that tail cut. Ooh! Oh, good stuff. That didn't even hit the head. Cool. Ooh! There it is. Kill! Conquer! Ooh. I was really banking on a flinch there. Fuck. It's like, am I gonna die again just because I want to be cool? No, don't, don't trap, don't trap, don't trap. Okay, okay. We're not, not trap, uh, cab. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, GG's. I thought I saw you getting ready to throw down like trank bombs and I was like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> yeah, GG's, y'all. Yeah, sorry about that death earlier. That was a silly one. Hopefully you get what you need though, Alun. You said you needed like shells or something like that, right? Is it shells or carapaces you need actually? Just to double check. Because if it's shells, then we should have probably been fighting the uh, low rank one then, no? Let's see if we can get the rare item from this. It's shell? Oh. So, yeah, we should have been fighting the low rank one. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. Hasn't it been? Well, this is high rank. We're getting carapaces and stuff. Ooh, two medulas, though. That's nice. 
<laughs> well, hey, Loon, on the bright side, you're going to have plenty of parts to upgrade immediately, you know? You're going to have all that already squared away. I thought that was flinch-free for a second. Ugh. Read the rest bay? Oh, bay? Oh my. That's how you see me now? We have enough data on the wildfire waste now. Let's go report to ecological research. Hasn't it been like for an hour? Wait, what? What do you mean, hasn't it been like for an hour? You mean like she's been fighting the uh, high rank one for an hour? Wolfie? Where'd Wolfie go? Did Wolfie crash? Ba, 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 ba. Ready to craft something? It said Wolfie left the session, no? Yeah, Wolfie left the online session. Where you at, Wolfie? What's up, player? I'm a player now. Ooh, ooh. He's breaking the fourth wall. All right. What bow do you guys recommend then? What do all you bow experts recommend? That only has power and close range, but it's always nice. Poison plus, so ooh. Are bows still recommended to go like element and all that? I mean, with ice, you kind of want to go element now, but. I know like in the older gen games and all that, usually bow was really great for element stuff. Like it still did really good stuff raw, but I know it was like you would usually go for element if I remember correctly. Unless you're doing like pierce. Oh no, I think I'm getting that mixed up though. Hmm. I don't actually know now. A little concerning. That's a lot of ice. Power, poison, and sleep as well. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice with the ice. <laughs> I might go for this one then. That seems pretty good. I think this is Valhazak. What the Diablo's bow? That's a negative affinity, but still, that's nice power. And we could buff it out, you know? Buff out the affinity. We don't have the Beetlejuice one because we haven't... Oh, there is no Beetlejuice one, actually, is there? Uh-oh. You say, what about a Blast one? Okay, that Devil Joe bow looks sick, though. 230 with just 25 negative affinity. Wait, what was the Diablo set? Does it have more... Wait, does it have more attack than Diablo then? It has power as well. I feel like this would be better again. It also looks cooler too, in my opinion. I don't know though, actually. Maybe the Diablos goes like up to 240, maybe 250. I don't know. And it has Dragon too, though. Dragon, High Elder Seal, only negative 25. I feel like I'd want to go for this one then, actually. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Yeah, and then especially with the Arc Tempered fights too, I think the Dragon would actually come in huge here too, if we do attempt to use the bow in those uh, fights. Hmm. Yeah, lots of choices. Sleep Plus, that's neat. I like the Rathalos bow too, that doesn't seem terrible either. It's probably gonna be low on the, like, raw damage though, I'm sure. I'd love to see what the upgraded Nergagante one does too though. That might be really good raw as well. It just doesn't have any other coatings. Yeah, this one would be much easier to up in Iceborne. Ah, that's true. That's a good point. That's a very good point. Oh. I'm 
Should I pick the wrong camp? Oh well. <laughs> That's very sweet of you, Wolfie, though, using your turn. shells so I'm assuming it's just kill again right yeah better chance with carving it okay My turn we can do uh Nergigante because I think Wolfie still needs Nergigante, right? Bear officially cannot read. <laughs> What's wrong now, Leo? <laughs> What's wrong, bud? What's wrong now? What do you say it's something in game or something? What are you talking about, Leon? About the needing shell? I was asking you what you meant by that, though. I was asking you what you meant by that, and you didn't explain on that. You said read the rest, and I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> I swear. Usually build my bows for element, but raw builds work fairly well too. Right. Let's see, was there any elemental things? And now everyone's confused now? Yeah. You keep saying that all the time, like I'm missing chat. And it's like, I keep telling you, if you're saying stuff in game, I'm not going to see it. So for the 50th time, War Globe, if you want me to see something, say it in Twitch chat, please. Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Otherwise, I'm just going to ignore you. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at the Devil Joe one. Devil Joe one would probably be pretty, pretty good. Can buff out the negative affinity fairly easy. Good dragon and everything, and good raw damage, too. Good stuff, good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, really open for flinch. Ooh. Let's see. Wake up. <laughs> So I might do that then, try and just go for like a bow build for every situation. Kind of tempted to look up what the, like which element bow people go for usually in the base game, like vanilla. Like in uh, vanilla and all that. And then build those now, this way I can upgrade into them further into Iceborne, you know? Similar to what uh, War Globe was saying. Stuff. Good cut. Good cut. Now it just dies. Oh. Oh, perfect. Just want to make sure we go for the head too.
GG's. GG's. Anyone got super glue? It's just that close, too. Dude, those are the best moments, though. You get a tail cut, right? You kill the monster, and then basically the tail is, like, right in the right section. You ate it? You ate the super glue? <laughs> I was saving that for later. Oh. It was going to be a right good dessert. Such a good dessert, you know? My favorite flavor glue is also blue. How about you? What's your favorite flavor glue? <laughs> oh. The super glue? Oh my god. I gotta go. I got nothing but ridges here. Jesus. Oh no, I got one shell. One shell. Here's hoping you got what you needed though, Alun. Here's open. We have enough data on the wildfire waste now. Let's go report to ecological research. God, the handler really wants me to just talk to them already. Alright, so... A lot of Piscean stuff here. But not many Piscean's. That's what's two birds, one stone. Look at a screenshot. Jesus. <laughs> That's funny. Got myself a Diablo spell now. Ooh, nice. Still in one piece, then. Fuck, I'm just autopiloting this. God damn it. In the old world, it makes makes its home in deserts and volcanic regions. I didn't expect to encounter one here. But I have to study it. If I let this chance slip away, I'll never forgive myself. I told the huntsman where Teostra can be found. Talk to him if you'd like to know more. Yeah, ugh, I'm autopiloting. That was unknown that posted a quest. Oh yeah, it's my turn. You still need their Gigante stuff, right? Right, uh, Wolfie? for a mount Buenos dias. I think Tiger's probably going to get the mount though because he's running um, Lance because <gasps> Lance still can't do the like it can still do the hop move right that was still a thing in world if I remember correctly like the move it can do in fortune and all that where if you do the uh, charge attack you can just do a jump if I remember correctly do one more rotation after this and then call the stream there The 4060 Ti and 4060 with prices starting at 
Huh. That's not bad. So is NVIDIA finally giving up trying to strangle people with these GPU prices? Are they finally giving up? Let's see. I'm gonna read more into it. I just saw like a little news article about it. Excuse you, I'm busy reading shit. Ugh. Let's see. So we'll arrive in, with the arrival of the 4060 Ti 8GB starting at $400. And then there's a 16GB version which will arrive in July. The 16GB version is $500. Jesus Christ. Fucking NVIDIA. Get... Ay, ay, ay. We need more RAM than just 8. I mean, if you're running 1080p, you don't. If you're running 1080p, you don't. You're above 1080p though, you do. <laughs> You're gonna need more. At least nowadays. <laughs> hey, nice bow there. <laughs> Ugh, I got greedy. Well, let's see, let's see. The 16, I don't know. $100 for double the VRAM. But then the 4060 with 8 gigabytes of VRAM. <laughs> Oh no. Hey, dude, Nergigante is like the great equalizer. It'll get you when you least expect it. I don't think that attack actually does mountain damage though. Yeah, there it is. Good stuff, good stuff. Fuck him up. I like how I just hear Leon noises. And Nergi is huge too. See, I gave up trying to determine whether or not one's huge or not. Because at this point, I'll be like, oh, that's massive. And I don't even get a silver crown. And I'm like, okay. I didn't eat that why. Oh. So you're taking after me now, I see. <laughs> oh. Thought I was going to be doing the, what is it, the quick reload one? I actually forgot I did a backup. Uh-oh. Oh. I almost died there. I'm hitting for 42 per explosive. Oh, so nice. So yeah, what is it? A 4060 uh, with eight gigabytes of VRAM. Again, if you're playing 1080p, that is perfect. $300, that's actually good. That's pretty good. If the TI was like 400 with the 16 gigabytes of video RAM, that would be even better too. But 500, I'm kind of like, uh... But yeah, a 4060 for 300, that's great. That is honestly great. So what was it? I think the 3060 for reference came out at 330. So I think Nvidia is finally starting to realize they can't keep, you know, can't keep the stranglehold they had usually, or they've been trying to do. And yeah, we gotta get that tail though. Uh, that's one of the reasons though, I'm looking at AMD for my next GPU whenever I do get that. Because I'm just over NVIDIA's bullshit practices. They don't want to lower prices so they can just keep taking advantage of that. And I'm sure they don't want to openly admit, yeah, it's just because of scalping and everything why we made so much money these last few years. Not because of our product. That's enough on the uh, GPU market rant. Yeah, 4060 seems to be coming out for 300. I wonder what the performance is going to be like, though. Because, like, real talk, if the 4060 is just as good as my, like, just as good, if not better, than my 2070 Super, I'm going to be like, hmm. $300 upgrade, though, I'm like, eh, but... $300, though, for a GPU is really nice. Very nice, especially for one like that. I'm trying to get these tails for... Shit, is he already low? Fuck. I also need the horns too. I was hoping to get the horn and the uh, tail. 
Guess I'm doing too much uh, explosive damage, actually. Ooh, good tail cut. If I'm going to be doing explosive damage, I need to be doing it on the head, actually. Because if I do it on the tail, all I can really help with is breaking off the crystals. Or not crystals, the uh, spikes. Jesus. Come on, let me get your head. Oh, I'm stuck on a wall here. Okay. Oh, well. <laughs> Well, uh, at least we got the tail. Good stuff, y'all. Got the charge blue bear. I'm so happy. Hell yeah. I'm glad to hear it. Oh, we carved a horn right there. Hell yeah. I didn't know you can just carve horns. They had to break them. That's good. Oh, we lost Opal. Oh, bow. Yeah, good stuff. Yeah, your damage went up so much. Holy shit. From 110 to 210. Good shit. I don't know how I feel uh, uh how much Slinger Thorn Monster. Well, I think some of that message got cut off there. I don't know how much or how I feel about how much Slinger Thorn Monsters give. Hmm. What do you mean by that? Like, just how often it drops and everything, or...? Welcome for that tail. Thank you, thank you. Oh? <gasps> Ooh, we got a horn there. Good stuff. And that's a talent. Hey, I'll take it, though. A horn in the rewards. That's good. I mean, I still need a gem, too, but hey, I'll take the horns. Heavy artillery. Okay. Heavy artillery and dragon attack. That's not bad. They dropped too much slinger ammo. Right. That's probably due to the whole change with, um, what's it called? Whenever anybody does any kind of tenderization now, it's going to drop ammo. But I did notice that you can't, what's it called? You can't, like, uh, spam flinch a monster like you could in vanilla. At least it feels like you can't. You know? Like, with the whole, like, each time you shoot any monster with special ammo, it always flinches them and everything. Was this the last one I didn't hear? That's the last one of this rotation, but the next rotation is going to be the last one for the day. Yeah. All right. So let's get in the next group. Let's see. Which is unknown and whiff, but Opal logged out of the uh, server. You still here, whiff? You still whiff us? <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, lordy. <laughs> that was good. I'm gonna be upset if she's not actually here because then she didn't hear it, you know? God damn it. God damn it, Whiff. Right, we're gonna put Whiff into the queue, but yeah, we have one open spot though if anybody wants it. Negative two. <laughs> Okay. So let's see. Because Diablo's bow would be a good, like, all-purpose bow, but I do want to do, like, just all around. Maybe we'll just build a Diablo's bow. We'll build a Diablo's bow and everything, and then, um, build other ones, out, like, along with it, you know? We can't make this because we're missing Majestic Horns, but can we upgrade to it? No, we still need more Majestic Horns? Okay. I'd rather just do that then. Yeah, just missing two. So we have the stuff for this one as well. Just this is what we're missing. Uh, I feel like that thing on the top is Xena Jiva. Yeah, power and paralysis. That's not bad. Unless we're getting the paralysis due to a skill. Hmm. Gotta admit, Nergi weapons are pretty good, but uh, Hunting Horner always miss her hit or miss for the songs, right? Let's see, actually. I mean, 
It's not bad. It has the earplugs and everything, you know? And then it has recovery stuff, which is nice. Um, And then the affinity up. Affinity up and health recovery. Affinity up is definitely nice too, but... Yeah, no attack up though. It's not bad damage too. Yeah, I think it's a good choice. Not a bad choice at all. So I feel like Opal might be done for the day and she might have just hopped off. So in that case, then we're going to grab a loon and Wolfie. Yeah, but like I never played a health recovery horn. It doesn't have shockwave, which I like, right? Though it does wreck my sharpness. Yeah, well, that's fair though. That's fair. Health recovery is nice if you're like using that like in the middle of a combo and everything, just keeping people alive, but uh, did I see a message go out? Teo or what needed? I mean I still need that Teo gem if you want to post that. Um personally speaking, I need Teo gem, um, Wrath Medulla, and then Nergigante gem and horns. That's what I need, but if you need something yourself, I'd rather you post that. <laughs> Ugh. Mostly, I don't know how big attack uh, large is compared to affinity up. Right. That's a good point. Well, because we have the true damage values and everything installed, uh, next time you play the song, see if you can, like, get a before and after, you know, look at your stats, see what happens there. I'm sure we can also look up how much the song does, too. You know, now let me go ahead and add a loon and Wolfie to the mix. Wolfie and a loon. Just check that in camp, yeah. Western world, ice war. I see the wiki for what the songs do and how long they last, but it doesn't say how much damage. Hmm. I don't know how much affinity gives, right? Yeah. I don't see anything like that right now from a quick search, but. We don't need the elements towards this, but I like the polisher and riser. If only temper and everything worked on um, Gunlance, that'd be fun. A little broken, but, you know, it'd be fun. Yeah, it's just bowgun damage, but also deviation. Okay. Well, well, well. Look what we have here. All right. And yeah, just beat the cat. No, I get it. Your <laughs> answer's like, what the fuck is on me? <laughs> Throw it into the wall. I want to break that face too. Come on, give me those horns, baby. I know the tail would also give us another chance for a gem, right? Ooh, good stuff. Good paralysis. Hope that counts for the head break. 
176 to 202, and I think it's a percentage. Damn. That's huge. So yeah, so unless the affinity is like maybe 20% or something like that, I don't know if that's worth it. And actually, I think attack up would still be more worth it actually at this point, Tiger, because again, we want like more what's it called? Um crit like critting and everything is still nice to have, but unlike in mass rank where we can get much higher values for like much more crit damage, just having a higher baseline attack is better, I think. Like at the end of high rank, you can start really going for affinity stuff because you have more attack then, but I think the attack one would still be better because that's a like a massive jump right there. Almost 30, like, true attack, by the way. You know, true attack. That's nutty. Ugh, I did it too early. Shit on, kid. Good tail cut. <laughs> Good stuff. Words and somebody in the corner is like, shut up. <laughs> oh, that went into that. Perfect. I was like, that's going to go into the uh, wing, isn't it? Dinging off the fucking arm. Ooh. Woo. Sweet. Goes all the spikes. Ah, damn it. Oh, Wolfie. Good kill. Good kill. Got so many fucking shinies to pick up. Let me get some cars first, actually. It's like... Ugh, let me carve. Hardly better. I don't think any affinity would counterbalance that. Um, however, second problem I have, both... Both attack horns don't benefit uh, gunlight shells, which bother me, because I like making the most of buffs. Right. No, that's actually a good point. But I mean... You know, affinity wouldn't really, affinity wouldn't really help the shelling either, though. No, it's like in that case, like none of that would really benefit, but the attack up and everything would just help with general, you know, damage all around. I think all that jazz, you know, getting gems. Yes, I need a gem and all that jazz. <laughs> so much jazz going on. <laughs> Yeah, trying to get a Nurgagante uh, gem now. Because we still haven't killed Xena Jiva, but I'm trying to get like a bunch of stuff grinded out and like ground. Almost said ground out. Oh my god. Grinded out and now and all that jazz. Oh my god, I keep saying jazz. I just want to listen to jazz, the monster jazz. Hey, look, a gem. Thank you for the luck there, kitty. I do appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, how you doing today, though? Now, thank you for the quest as well, guys. Good hunt. Good hunt. How to benefit your stake. That's why I said both attack horn and affinity too. Oh, okay. You want to use that more? Yeah. I use the stake as often as I can, to be fair. You know? I do use that as often as I can. <sighs> yeah, the attack boost is definitely nice, though. I, I'm personally of the whole, like, yeah, go for attack over affinity, but... Why did you have to get a gem when I got here? I don't know. You just, you just brought over the luck, and I appreciate it. 
Thank you, thank you. And so now all we need now is just the um, Xenojiva part, whatever that is. We have the horns, we have the talents. Thank you guys very much. And I think now we can get the... Yeah, we can get this now too. Which means we actually don't need that Rathalos thing anymore, actually, if we're going for this. Okay, let's put it on now, actually, yeah. Be super edgy. Hmm. Because again, even though weakness exploit doesn't really work with the shelling and all that, my reasoning for going for the Rathalos one originally was just like, oh yeah, we can use the attack boost too, right? But we're going to be putting on the booty shorts whenever we get this artillery gem, or yeah, this uh, artillery charm maxed out, which we need a Teostra gem for. When we get that, then we're going to put on this. We're going to have attack boost level 7 going on. Um, yeah, we're going to have attack boost level 7, weakness exploit 2. Let's see. Let's make sure we have everything right. Let's see, let's see. So, when we get that artillery charm upgraded, it's going to make sure we have attack boost level 7, artillery 3, weakness exploit 2, um, evade extender 2, health boost 1, capacity boost, and then guard 1. Um... You know, what's it called? Uh, when we when we beat Xena Jiva as well, Xena Jiva, we are going to be able to get our guard up jewel from that quest from the ice mod, which means we can slot that in here one like one of these places. So we can actually right now have technically either evade extender level three because I think we have a third evade jewel, or just keep the evade extender two with guard up as well. So this is going to be a really nice tasty build, and then we have that one like the one deco slot at the legs, but I think that's going to be the same with the Dober stuff. Let's see i think the dober stuff has yeah so yeah we have a one slot that we can work with too it doesn't have to be health boost but you know it's neat and that didn't have any decorations so we're gonna miss the speed uh speed gathering and all that but still and we're only gonna have guard level one but you know that's fine that's fine i think we'll make it work hey Barry, you can skip my turn are you sure okay Got what I needed? Hell yeah. I'm trying so hard to prove that I don't bring gems. <laughs> Literally been dubbed the queen of RNG because I get gems. And other rare things really easily. Nice. So I'm going to need you to show up to all my streams actually from now on, Kitty. For no particular reason, you know. <laughs> no particular reason. <laughs> no. All jokes, though. No, thank you, though. <laughs> thank you for your great luck. I do appreciate it. Look at my build now. Hell yeah. I don't need anything now. Cool. Well, I appreciate it. All right, in that case, then, uh, let's do some Teo. Do I have Teo, though? I don't think I have a Teo investigation. I don't think I can get one either until I do the actual story beat. This has really good rewards, but only one faint. Um, I might have to do the story quest, then, to unlock that, which is fine. Yeah, and this can't be upgraded either for a while until we beat Xenochiva, I think. All right, let me go do the story beat real quick. Oh, yeah, I gotta look at your build, too. And <laughs> Noted, yeah. And legally by law, you are now required to be at every stream, kitty. You know? Sorry, it happens. I don't make the rules. I just enforce them at this point. You know? It's funny, though, because... What's it called? We've been getting pretty lucky with most things, except, like, uh... What's it called? Um, Like, these gems and everything, they're being a bit rough to get, but we're getting a lot of plates, like, free willy-nilly in the beginning... We already got, like, we've had six moments where we've seen Downy Craig spawn on Apsaros in the Wild Spire. We got the Marlin the first time we looked in the water and everything in the Ancient Forest at the beginning of the playthrough. So we're already getting some of the rare endemic life. We already got a shit ton of plates and everything. Yeah, let's look at uh, Wolfie's build real quick. Unknown has uh, two silver and one gold tail. Oh, really? Must have missed that. Yeah, if you don't mind, uh... I greatly appreciate that quest. Yeah, that'd be nice. Thank you, thank you. So what do you got going on? Diablo's Coilbender. Ooh. You got the Nergante stuff too. Nice. Oh, this is very nice. Yeah. Max Stamina Surge. Agitator level 3, which is going to give you... How much again? Yeah, 7 Infinity and 12 Attack. Oh, yeah. You're going to be doing a lot of raw damage, yeah. Nice and tasty. And you even have a deco slot open, too, there. Very nice. And you have upgrades you can even get as well. Yeah, good stuff. 
I think it's the Huntsman, right? What? Teostra. So this is the Elder Dragon that's been strutting about the waste. My old friend, my old enemy. <laughs> it was the Emperor of Flame that left these gashes in my armor, and now we will face each other again. Any hunter worth his salt will be grateful for the chance to test his skills against such an opponent. Are you with me? Sign up for the quest and we shall pursue Teostra to the Elder's Recess. See, he says we. Going after it will definitely put all of your skills to the test. I think you'll be okay with a full belly. Thank you. I, you know, they keep saying we, but canteen store outside. Well, cool. Ooh. I'm glad I came back down here then. Yeah, we got to do a lot of optionals though too. All right, let's head back up to the gathering hall. What would be so much better with followers? That'd be cool. Just learned a hunting horn mechanic. Oh, what is that? Oh, hello. Hey, I forgot to ask. How was your day so far, by the way, Kitty? I don't remember if I asked that or not. <laughs> I just really like, wait, shit. <laughs> yeah, how's your day going so far? Oh, only two faints, though. Ooh, spicy. We proceed to do nothing, sit on his ass. Yeah. Ooh. Defender high, riser high, acrobat, attack 10. Oh. It's very nice. And then we have our demon drug we can drink, which gives us another five. Oh, it's going to be spicy. We still need to get our fire mantle, though. Do we have that yet or no? We only have waterproof and thunderproof. And then we have the ice proof available to us, but we have to kill a Palumu and get Palumu parts. Palumu? Yeah. Like not, yeah. No, I genuinely hope they keep the follower mechanic from Sunbreak into future Monster Hunters. I love the idea of it in Frontier, and I'm so glad it made its way into Sunbreak, and I hope it stays. Because then again, it allows players that either play offline or don't play with other people to still have a cooperative experience in a way. So I hope they keep that. You guys joining for the quest? Looking snazzy, you two. Oh, yeah. Usually I have my weapon pose thing there. I miss having my weapon pose set on console. Dude, doing the, uh, what is it? Like, Guts' pose and everything with a greatsword? So cool. That's a lot of weight on just one arm, too. Can we talk about that? You have a shield that looks like about 50 pounds itself, and then a gun lance, which is probably just as heavy, if not more. On one arm. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I appreciate the investigation here, though. Thank you, unknown. Let me do this real quick. This over the edge. I don't like how close it is to Days of Baron Monkey. And we can always move this over as well, actually. Yeah, I'll just keep it there. Don't mind me. Don't look behind the curtain, everybody. Let me in. I always take the freebies. It's there. Stick direction, right? You mean like just doing different attacks with the stick direction? Yeah. I need to play some Hunting Horn too, actually, at some point. Can't let you have all the fun. <laughs> I just gotta make sure I'm not double upping on the, uh... On the uh, songs you're playing. Oh man, we don't mind quickly anymore. Oh, I miss it. Dude, dude also has a stick direction? Right, yeah. Right, gotta break uh, the face. I think a tail cut too also increases the chances for a gem, right? Like the carve. There's another one right there, but... Eh. So every attack can have a stick direction input? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. 
Oh, but most yeah. No. It's pretty cool. What's it called? Um, I remember when I first found that out too, I was just like, wait, what? <laughs> uh, did my attack just go right through his face? Excuse me. Mm, I want to say I just had depth perception issues there. <laughs> depth issue. My face feels funny. Oh, charred. Throw it out to people so others don't have to heal. A good flash. That missed too. What the fuck? Ah, oh, right into the armpit. You know, the weak spot of a Teo strip. Not to be confused with the other weak spot of a Teo, it's the Teo tank, you know? Guaranteed to kill him instantly. Uh oh. Woo! Spicy. Ow. I just healed that. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh. I was like, I don't think I could block that, so I'm just gonna hop away. <laughs> ba, ba, ba. Uh oh. Woo. Come on, give me that. Ah. <clears throat> Whatever, let me just hit the fucking monster. I want to throw it into a wall, but it's not near anything. Oh, eh? we do that here. Very good flash. Right in the face. Oh, perfect. Get him, boys. Sweet. I don't have my worm steak. Ugh. Hoping I can get to the uh, quick reload. Oh, oh, spicy. My health casually burning away, you know, nothing crazy. Is that the face that was broken there? Let me work on the tail too. Ugh, we went way too far forward. God, the FPS though is dropping like crazy right here. Maybe because of all the effects going on. Hey, don't dissipate my. Pods. Face is still intact. We gotta fix that. Uh oh. Goodbye. <gasps> Goodbye. Let's grab another pod. Oh yeah, for anybody who was asking about the Elder Seal before too, the Dragon Pods, for example, those also have Elder Seal built into it as well. So you can kind of like shoot those a ton to try and proc the uh, seal effect. If you're curious. <laughs> Only Elder Seal actually had a duration? Yeah. It's like, I like the idea behind it, but it just feels gimmicky the way it is now, you know? And I don't think uh, Ice did anything to really change that, or if they even could change anything about Elder Seal. Oh! Uh. Wake up, on own. You gotta get up, bud! Oh, and I'm on fire again. How the hell am I on fire? Woo! Oh, we landed it. Perfect. And I'm on fire again. God damn it. It's horribly implemented, and there's no reason to move that functionality away from poison. Right. I don't mind moving it away from poison, just I don't like the way they went about implementing Elder Seal. Like, I like the idea of having like an additional thing, like a mechanic like that, but... 
Yeah. Good flash. I keep forgetting we're not in I like we're not in master rank. We can just spam flash bombs. You know? Bring it back to the glory days of old Monster Center where you can just spam flash bombs like crazy. Good shot there. Good kill, you guys. Let's ignore I'm still on fire. Ignore we're all on fire, actually. Or by all, I mean just me and unknown. <laughs> Goddamn. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I wouldn't mind. Oh. Holy shit. We got it, boys. Thank you very much, everybody. Today's been super productive, thanks to you guys. I really do appreciate all the help. I hope you guys were able to get stuff you needed too. Only carrots fight monsters while not actively burning to death, uh huh. <laughs> Next time we fight a Zenith monster, I don't want to see you above 55 element resistance then for it, all right? <laughs> I want to see that Zenith fire blight. Let it burn like your soul's, <laughs> like your soul's passion in the hunt. All that jazz. We'll both go into the Zenith Z4 Rathlos together without Z or what is it? 55 Rath or whatever. Fucking hell. I don't know anymore. I can't talk. I'm tired. Hey, look at all these tails. Nice. Uh, what is that? Weakness? Sword? Critical draw. Ooh. To any great sword uh, experts in chat. Does crit draw work if you do the slinger true charge slash combo? Like you unsheath to start charging, you do the slinger pod shot, and then you go into true charge. Does that still count as a draw attack or no? I'm assuming not, right? Just curious. Appreciate the help. Got one too? Hey, let's go. Two with more than one tail? Where are the hidden ones? We don't want to talk about that. No? Yeah. It's like that technically doesn't count, right? I still like crit. I don't like that. God, I still love crit draw builds though. They're fun, especially with Frostcraft. All right, so with that, oh, what am I doing? So that being said, we now have our. We now have our uh, what's it called? Gunlance build. We have our gunlance build optimized to where we want it to be, at least right now. Now let's pull out the booty shorts, everybody. If you do stare at my cheeks, though, you owe me a tier three sub. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Cool. Whip it now. That's upgraded, that's upgraded. Chest is upgraded, yeah. Okay. Right. So again, we don't really have many good level one decos. I'd love to get flinch free so we can just slot that in there and not have to worry about that anymore, but unfortunately we don't have it yet. We could put dragon in there to give it more dragon damage, but technically that would be, you know, 25% increase in dragon element, but eh, we we're using a gun lance. I mean, the worm steak does now do elemental damage, but that's not really, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I guess it would technically be more damage though, right? We could also just go speed sharpening, but vitality is nice too. Oh, we don't have a third uh, evade extender. Yeah, we don't really have many good uh, ones here, huh? I guess we could get this, but eh, it's not really worth it. Um, I mean, steadfast, that's not bad. But it feels really worth it if you have three. I mean, it still helps, though. So. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just put Dragon in here for now. What a weird, you know, deco to put there. I'm sure Fuhrer would be better for the damage you get from red health, but... Eh. Yeah, we'll just do this. Maybe Grinder might be better, though, too. 
But we don't really worry about sharpening in the middle of battle too often. All right. So, here's our final build now until we get guard up from the Xenojiva quest. We're going to have attack boost 7, artillery 3, weakness exploit 2, uh, evade extender 2, health boost 1, dragon attack 1, capacity boost 1, and guard. And then when we do beat Xenojiva, we're going to get the guard up deco, which is going to replace the dragon attack. Very happy with this build. And again, it translates very well with Charge Blade as well. Charge Blade probably want a bit more guard, so you can really, you know, get a guard point off and then really punish with it, but eh, it is what it is. I'm looking respectfully. Yeah, you better. Sun's out. <laughs> Gun's out. Just crit draw regular silly? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I still need to put together that crit draw build you have in Sunbreak there, uh, War Globe. Look at your set now. What do you got? Ooh, ooh. Artillery three, folk or weakness exploit three, focus three, attack boost two, health boost two, capacity boost guard. Yeah. Non-element boost two. Yeah, that's very nice. Very nice build. I was gonna say if you can get your hands on getting to attack boost level four somehow alone um you'd be able to actually get like uh you'd actually still be able to crit oh wait no you have yeah duh it's 50 percent at level three i thought you had level two weakness exploit for some reason i'm thinking about my own thing yeah you're good never mind I mean, you still could get more like uh you know, if you do go the attack route but what you have right now is perfect that's great especially for high rank you could technically get even more damage focus if you run the, what is it, Draconic set, you know, the Dragoon set, but yeah, that's just going kind of like, you know, meta using does that armor set. It's a bit boring. All right. So that was, that was the Loon's Quest. Wolfie, what do you want to hunt? Hello. What do you want to hunt, bud? Do you have anything you want to hunt? Did you already post a quest? Alun, you're, you're still in the rotation. What are you doing in that quest? <laughs> she was about to abandon us. You want to do the story too? Okay. Oh, that reminds me. Let me watch the cutscene then and I'll join your quest. Let me watch the cutscene and I'll join your quest, okay? Yeah, because that... Oh, we join you? Uh-oh. Well, ugh. And we can still eat. So which one of us is going to back the Teostra? You or me? <laughs> I like a good cup. <laughs> now this is what I was born to do. Huntsman, you don't is really into this. <laughs> Watching him is getting me pumped too. I didn't eat because I thought I was gonna be joining his. I'm like, why eat, you know, and then just waste the uh, food buff, you know? Yes. What's it called? Uh yeah, I like the huntsman, like who's gonna bag him? You or me, and he's not even here, and it's like my guy. What are you on about? So we have all the account items here. I think we're still missing one of the ones from the Wild Spire. I think we have the ones in the Ancient Forest. I think we're missing the fossil from the Rotten Vale. And in the Coral Highlands, I don't remember if we have. Right, you know what? Let me not mine here. I do need more Fusium, but I don't want to keep everybody waiting. The teal would die waiting from the arrive, yeah. <laughs> stop looking, stop. 
Yeah, I saw that. Fan service camera angles. That's a cool intro, though. Them cheeks, I swear. I'm looking disrespectfully, I swear. I love these intros so much. Where you at, uh, Huntsman? Where's this competition going on? Oh, why are you in the lava? Get out of the lava. Ooh. Ah. Uh oh. Ugh, should have dodged. Like, can I get into the guard point? Uh oh. Ugh, too early. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, what a dumb way to die. Oh, never mind. We get away scot free. <laughs> I'm just kind of not even giving well, this fight the respect it deserves. All right, come here, buddy. Got to kick your ass now. Ugh. There we go. Oh, that we're gonna dodge far enough. Ba, 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 ba. That's another detail actually I really liked. What is it? Um, when you fight these elder dragons like at their nest area and everything, they kind of get stronger in a way because they can make use of the environment. How am I stunned again? Jesus! Thank you. I do appreciate. It. Here, I have some health. Oh. I'm thinking my uh, guard point's gonna last longer than I think it does. Jesus, I'm getting it twice and I get a ton. What the heck? Huntsman is camping, honestly. Huntsman's being a leech right now. Uh, somebody report Huntsman, please. I'm just waiting for Teo to die so they can swoop in for rewards. Teo looks like an old man. Yeah. <laughs> You're not wrong. He's just a scrunkly little fella, you know? Oh! I mean, to be fair, I feel like I look like a scrunkly old man now and then. 25 years old and I feel like an old man sometimes. <laughs> He's monologuing. <laughs> I do like how they do that though, like real talk, like, I do like the idea of like story quests like this where you have, uh, you know, it's supposed to be a big moment and everything, you know? And I'm hit with Blast Blade. Ugh. Hold that for me, thank you. <laughs> Man, I got Frontier on the brain. I like looked into that direction and be like, all right, if I push forward the unlock stick here and then I do the dodge mode, it's going to have me dodge the other way because you can only back hop. Then I do a forward hop and I'm like, wait, <laughs> wait. 
Wrong gen. Perks of bouncing between monsters. Oh! Uh. Man, I hate the fact that when you block an attack, you still get with the blast points, and I'm just sitting Oh, everybody's going full. Oh, everyone's flying. Here, have a life powder, everyone. On me. Fuck it, I'm sending it. Woo! I'm like 12 mentally, but 84 physically, yeah. Honestly, kitty, I feel that. <laughs> still make dumb fart jokes and I just sit here with my own laugh track <laughs> just <laughs> it's how the way the world works how you doing by the way Beth uh oh Ooh. hope you're having a wonderful day today do you like my character's booty shorts it gives me more attack power I wish I was joking with my cheeks unchained I do more damage Oh, I gotta sharpen. Feel a little slut. Oh! When your own mods uh, slut shame you. I swear. What the fuck? Oh, hey, usually helps if I have ammo, huh? Ow! Ew. Damn. Nice try. A good flash though the first time, though. <laughs> Let me go back to mining. Yeah, if he's not low on health, he's just gonna come back then, huh? Isn't there like a mining point in here I can grab real quick? Look how much damage these do. Oh, okay. Just throwing rocks at a TO stream, you know? Well, good thing you got a good view, you know, standing wherever the hell you were. Let's steal all the way, yeah. Scrunkly slut, thank you. I feel like the Baron Monkey's nipples staring at me every time it lights up, as it should be. It knows when you make eye contact, by the way. I hope you realize. I don't know why I'm gathering this. I don't need the points. I already have the item. He's on your shoulder right now, basically. Oh. Oh my. Stop. <laughs> GG's. I guess we can do another one, then it's the final quest for the day. Again, all I'm missing is just Xeno Jiva now for the Gunlance upgrade, and I'm done with that. We could farm, uh, do a quick little Rathian, because I need spikes and everything for the Charge Blade. You know? Two Fortitude Jewels. Oh my. What's the game trying to say? Eh? It's weird seeing Monster look so not old. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's fair. Well, this game's pretty. I'm noticing there's like a lot of weird bugs because I have the high text, like high resolution pack installed, but it doesn't look installed though, you know? So I need to make sure if ice is properly grabbing because it has to be in like a special location if I remember correctly. I need a Rathian Ruby. Oh, I mean, there we go. Good work. Impressive. I bow to your skill. Besting Teostra is no ordinary hunter's feat. Today you stand amongst the truest and the finest in our field, and I consider it an honor to know you. We hunters must treasure our equals and rivals. The spirit of competition is what drives us to shine brighter. The dents in my armor remind me of the past, but a shining star like you shall guide me to the future. Nice. Right, let's go fuck up a uh, Rathian then. I would like to think Huntsman was on our shoulders like a piggyback, yeah. <laughs> Bum, bum, bum. Hmm. I mean, Pink Rathian also drops the uh, spikes too, right? Like about the same chance. I think it's... Is it better or worse, actually? I don't remember. And we want to kill a Rathian because we can carve the spikes. It's, it's a lot of silver. 
Anybody have any good Rathian investigations or no? Is the only really good one I have is this. Like, I have the uh, other one, but that's like a capture. And I want to kill this one. Rathian spike break back in a uh, tail? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. The back break's the annoying one, but... Imagine seeing all... Or saying all that to a dude in booty shorts. <laughs> Ugh. Hold on. Do I have any funny just wait? <laughs> I'm the one that killed the Tio. Thank you. <laughs> Do not tempt me. Yeah. Ooh, okay, that's two of them. I actually like that a lot. I do like that a lot. Even though it's like one bronze and two silver, that's two of them, though. That's nice. You got one? Um, What's the one you have, uh, Alun? This is a double Rathian, so it's twice like the amount of uh, carves for spikes and all that. That's pretty nice. Huh? Thirty six devil's blight. Good stuff. I thought you said Rathos. Nah, Rathian, yeah. Because yeah, I need those Rathian spikes for the charge blade upgrade. All good. All good. Well, we got this one at least. Yeah, thank you, Unknown. Thank you again. Yeah, thanks for coming to clutch with a lot of these investigations. <laughs> Oh, Beth, look how good the food looks, dude. Oh, it makes me so hungry. It's the main reason why I just kind of skip it. That in like the time, but like, oh. Oh, it's so oh. Brings a tear to my eye, dude. Oh. I've seen people do that too, like on the subreddit people are like, yeah, me and my like fiance and everything did like a monster hunter dinner tonight. And they do their own version of it. I just sit there like, oh, because they have like jumbo shrimp and a nice like uh prime rib cut and everything, lots of fried rice. I'm just like oh. oh. And then what's it called? Uh yeah, when you get to the iceborne and everything, the DLC, like the expansion and all that, um, you have the grand you know, like grand meowster chef or what is it like, like you know, the Mima, Babushka, cat, and everything that makes the meals? I think you've seen it before, but then you have like that whole, uh, that Grand Meow, Grand Meow Chef, or and all that. And you have like the cheesy stew based, um, meals over there, and it's just, it's so good. Oh, hello. Howdy. Wee. Wee. I'm getting a text I need to respond to. There we go. <laughs> ski daddle, ski doodle. I'm taking this. I'll come over and make a couple's dinner with you. You better. You fucking better. All right, Pinkrathian, you're not supposed to chase me this far. Pinkrathian. <laughs> she wants the booty shorts. That's it. And it always goes back to the booty shorts. Oh. Put that wind pressure away. Ooh. Excuse me, hold on. I just I just need to get to that tail real quick. Thank you. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Kinda rude. Oh, the tail's already off. What the fuck am I doing then? I'll hit it eventually, guys. Don't y'all worry. See I hit it. And it's Fucking wind pressure. Look. 
Boy. Boy. Wasn't that kicking your ass? Speaking of food, what's up? Ooh, hey, there's one already. Oh, so near care of us. Perfect. All right, I mean, you got to kill this thing too, because uh, capturing it reduces um, opportunities for spikes, if I remember correctly, reading it offline. I just got to fast travel. Fuck that. I can't while in combat. I mean, with what? The Gajalaka? Uh. Can I hide in the cactus? <laughs> I was like, those gotcha like better not know I'm still there or some shit. Speaking of food, I was looking at places to eat yesterday before heading to the continent. I was super hungry for most of the day. Um, I was drooling so much looking at the menus to see if they served vegetarian for carrot. Oh, man. I was self hydrating like crazy. Yeah. Oh, I can imagine. I can imagine. And the scout flies are tracking the other one. Own autopilot, kids. <laughs> There's a basil? Wait, huh? Wait, oh. Getting my quest? Okay. Oh, we still need to kill a basil juice, actually. Or basil geese. Wait a minute. Basil geese. Isn't basil geese really, like, literally meant for gunlance, too? Why the fuck have I not been killing beetle? Oh. Watch, in before the beetle, like, the beetle juice set and everything is just everything I needed and more. I swear. It's not for gun lights. I thought it was, wasn't it? Oh, it didn't hit the bomb. Oh, well, that worked. <laughs> I thought it was going to hit the bomb from over there. Rise, yes. Ah, I might be thinking of that, then. Might be thinking of Rise, then. Oh. Oh, hey, a plate. Oh, hey, a plate. Jesus Christ. Oh. That's metal as hell. Yeah, I'm thinking of, uh, what's it called then? I'm thinking of Sunbreak then. I'm rising on it. My wake up. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. Ooh, good flash. Good flash. And I need to not explode on the tail there. Ooh, good shot. Ah, fucking up about my combos now. I'm fucking up my combos. Oh, where did my health go? I kind of suck because I, uh, I found a spot I would like going, but no option for it. Right. That's unfortunate. It's like that's still going to hit right, and I was right. Ah, oh, uh, the first one was going to bite. I think I'm one hit away from being uh, stunned, though, so I need to be careful. Good stuff, y'all. Wrong spot. Chi 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 y'all. How many spikes do you need again to make this entire charge blade? Because you needed like what is it, two or three to make the first one, right? Or four? Then you need three on the step I'm on right now, and I know you need more later. Jeez, everybody's just getting the good cars today. Oh, good stuff. 
plate. Nice. I think Wolfie got a gem though, no? Maybe he got a plate as well, actually. This and this for Athene Spike Nightmares. Oof, I can imagine. Yeah, you just need a shit ton of spikes and everything. I gotta respect your choice, but man, sometimes I just wanna eat. Yeah, I get it. It sucks when a place doesn't have a. Excuse me. Sucks when a place doesn't have options, though, you know? It really does. End up at a place where the noodles are handmade and it was quite good. I just wish my stomach was as big as a few years ago. Yeah. Oh, that's an end screen. Um, and then in the rewards. Feels bad. I like that. Just a screenshot. Flint tree? Yeah, no flint tree. What kind of option you looking for for carrot? It was just vegetarian stuff. Because uh, carrot's a vegetarian. You know? You know, you know? Alright, cool. Well, thank you guys so much for all the help today. Got a lot done. I think I'm missing one more spike from getting that charge blade upgrade. <laughs> and I don't know how many I need for the other ones, though. I'm sure a lot, but... Oh, wow, there's a lot of people to talk to now for quest. Oh, boy. All right, we're going to deal with that another time. Um, So tomorrow, tomorrow I'm going to be taking off from stream, and then we're going to be streaming Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Okay, all righty. All right, with that being said, though, if you guys haven't already, be sure to join the Discord like Unknown just posted. Uh, hanging out after stream, getting updates on the stream, or hanging out with other people like Monster just as much, if not more than I do. The socials, YouTube for VODs, Twitter for shitposting, and the TikTok for funny little clips. And now let's go look for somebody to raid. It's air annoying because I like eating everything, but yeah, no, I get it though. I get it. You want to make sure Kara can eat something too, and something good as well. Not just something basic like how some places are like, yeah, we have vegetarian options, and you get there and it's like, oh, it's a basic ass salad, and that's a nothing else. And it's like, oh. <laughs> yeah, I get it though. Oh, Cryptic's on. Yeah, Cryptic. Yeah, let's throw to Cryptic. I forgot she has her world stream today. Yeah, I'm going to throw you guys over to Cryptic. She's streaming some world. Be sure to give her the same amount of love you guys give me, all right? That being said, I will see you guys next time on Saturday at 11 a.m. Eastern, all right? <gasps> bye bye Full diaper alchemist. <laughs>